Hey, what's going on YouTube? Swift bringing you a brand new Dead Frontier 2 stream today. Hope everyone is doing well. Give everyone a moment here. Just thought I would keep the theme for uh, the series going with the dragon slaying. So we're going to continue that. I've created a lobby and actually let me get that uh, info over to you guys here. I mean, I mean to do, uh, do that right off the bat so everyone can join in. We have a lobby uh, for everyone who want to join in and we can take on some dragons. So we're going to get that all i will set up in a little bit here because there's an outpost attack going on right now. That said, I'm in the middle of, let's see, what was I doing here? I'm in the middle of running PCA too. Let me see. Oh, don't mind all this. That's, uh, that's the, uh, Market play that I have in mind. I think I think it'll be antiseptic spray later, or one of the one more day is going to be antiseptic spray. So I just was buying a few of those. Yeah, okay, we're going to go to PCA. Uh, so I I left off first floor. I finished the first floor. I was going to go through the other floors while this outpost defense is going on. I figure give everyone some time to, you know, get in the server, but also, uh, you know, time for these uh, purple zones to get back in sync. So we'll run and do that real quick. Thank you for the like. I appreciate that. Welcome, everybody. And like I told you guys on, you know, the other videos, anytime I see a Neon zombie out in the field, unless it's like Dalbo, I take them out because they give you the extra XP. I also wanted to say right off the bat, thanks again for 1K subscribers, guys. Thanks for uh, the support. Um, you know, means a lot. So let's keep it going. We are at PCA. Okay, so we're going to go second floor. Let me just this stuff. I'm a hundred credits away from uh, getting the enhanced uh, dragon onslaught. So I can show you guys maybe during the stream uh, how that craft turns out. Tendril, tendril, tendril. All right, so I'm gonna door kill a little bit. I'm not in, I'm not bothered by the tendril. I just sometimes I get sloppy when I fight the tendril, so I do want to take out a couple more of the zombies. All right, we should be good. It's basically a four shot. The Neon Zombie is almost stronger than the Tendril. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Because this is a three shot. Oh, for me. Welcome, everybody. Uh, and unless it's good stuff, I'm not going to be picking it up right now. It's kind of been my rule lately. Oh, we'll take
some peanut butter. So if you guys have been following the uh, what's been going on with the market, um, remember I told you guys, oh yeah, it could be uh, peanut butter. I wasn't that far off because it was chocolate spread. I mean, it kind of looks the sim, you know, the similar uh, uh, item designs. It's like I'm telling you, one of these days, it's gonna be, it's gonna be peanut butter. That's my thinking. All right, let's solve this puzzle. I think the only way is for it to go down because nothing else makes sense. Um, and that's not gonna work. So I need it to go that way. This isn't going to work, so it has to be this way. No, that doesn't seem like that works. Nope. I usually get these two. This one's kind of tricky. That one, uh, oh. I don't think it's any of that, it's all over here. The only way you gotta kind of go in reverse, maybe that's it. So, all for a superior. <laughs> Hey, you know, you, you never know. Okay, so let's continue on here. Thirty eight special rounds, not very very uh, profitable. Thank you for the like. Appreciate it. All right. So we are running through PCA here. You thought you were going to get me. Okay. I didn't bring as much ammo this time, so I'm going to make this work. I think it's right here. Aim for, aim for the back of the head of... Sometimes that can be a tough, a tougher shot. All right. Oh, here we go. I was just thinking in my head. I was like, oh, I hope I get some ammo. Well, there you go. Got some ammo. So yesterday, guys, I got a, a unique from here. Uh, what was it? Uh, Do Dodger's Breast. It's worth like 800k. So that was really awesome. If that sells tonight, it's the lowest price. If that sells tonight, then I'll be able to make the enhanced uh, onslaught.
I just keep flooding in the room here. Okay, nice. So we took care of those. Got a book. I'm not really trying for books. Like, except for the invitation, obviously. Okay. Okay, good. And I can save on my rifle rounds a little bit. Okay, uh, that should be the second floor. We can go to the third floor now. Sugar Dragon, nice. Hello, everybody. Hey, thanks for the likes, guys. Appreciate it. How's everyone doing? We are running through PCA real quick. Uh, I think the outpost defense just wrapped up, so I was just kind of running through this in the meantime while that was going on. Um, I'm still trying for the invitation, kind of. You know what I mean? Like, if I get it, great. Uh, it's kind of like a side goal right now, you know. Lower priority because of the event. Oh, we got twins. We got twins. Well, let's let's door kill here a little bit. Mr. Q, can I see your skill build for rifle? Oh, hey, yeah. Uh, what's up there? What's up there, Q? Um, yeah, uh, absolutely. Give me one second. We're gonna take on this. Uh, Boss here. Let's take on the boss. There we go. Uh, I guess that wasn't. Too oh, that was good. Heh. That item was better than the rare. Uh, yeah, sure. So let me uh, let me reload. Here. All right, so um, you wanted to see the skill build for rifle? Yeah, absolutely. So um, as far as skills go, guys, um, we'll scroll down past all the uh, the buffs and event stuff. So um, for me, I'll just kind of go through them, you know, 10, 15 seconds each one. Sprinter, I have Sprinter 5. I think speed makes a difference in, you know, survival so i try to be as fast and run as far as i can with sprint because i'm a running gun style player so this is like my main i always put this first with my rifle build uh jogger five right now um depending on if i when i enhance the dragon's onslaught if i get jog speed to a certain point I might go Jogger 4 here, but that's more of an advanced, like that's more of down the line thought, but Jogger 5 for right now for the jog speed. Um, toughness 5. These aren't necessarily rifle skills. They're kind of overall, but I, I incorporate them into my build. Uh, so you get the health here and, you know, you minimize some of that stun time or, you know, getting getting stunned by the, the zombies. Um marksman is an automatic like marksman aim speed accuracy range like this for me marksman five is auto i i do this every time without without hesitation because when you get your range to a certain point you don't need any more range 
but I don't want like equipment, like a skill to be range here because if I get enough here, then I don't need that on my gear. So that we, we don't need any more range. So this, this handles that. Uh, obviously the accuracy, the aim speed. Quick shot, uh, aim speed. And then you see there the different uh, weapons like pistol, shotgun. So whichever build you go with, Quick shot will cover you as long as it's not melee. Melee, you wouldn't want any points in quick shot unless your backup weapon was one of the other weapons, right? Uh, is that sprint? Is that sprint is running? I see many people moving so fast, but I don't know that is walk, sprint, or jog. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, I'll show you. Uh, we'll go back to this. Uh, we'll go to reloading when, when I go back so like if i'm just kind of moving around in here like that this is this is jog speed if i'm aimed in and i'm walking this is walk speed this is walk speed if i'm holding down shift or whatever button is for sprint this is sprint so um there is a bit of a difference in in each one um for me, I have the least walk speed, so that's where I'm trying to get better at. Thank you. Yep, thanks for the question. Um, we'll just wrap up here with the rest of these real quick. Um, reloading 5, I think this is like an automatic 2. Like I was telling you about walk speed. I don't think I have enough walk speed. So the fact that 25% is here, this has kept me in the game. Like, I have something. But but the maximum is 200. So really, there's a long way to go. You want to reload quick, have a lot of ammo, etc. Um, and then obviously, specific to rifle, you know, you'd want to max out this rifle expert, level 5. I go for headshots, so I go with Headhunter 5. I'm, I'm kind of going against the bosses, which are the, the bosses, like, you know, the bigger enemies. They are considered to be mutated. So I go with damage versus mutated. With my secondary weapon, I have a shotgun. Really, it's like a co-primary is how I use the shotgun, but... These are the shotgun numbers. And then uh, I'm going to be adjusting this mule. You can have inventory if you want to. I'm not going to discourage that. Me personally, I think I have enough. So um, being that I don't have a backpack, when I have a backpack, I'm going to get a lot more, right? Um, that said, I'm going to be, when I reset my stats one more time, I'm going to be subtracting Mule, and I'm going to go with either Survivor 5 or Medic 1. It just depends on the role I get from the Enhanced uh, Onslaught. If I'm going to pull another point from Jogger, I'll, I'll put it a point in Medic, probably. So um, that's the skills, and then I'll show you quickly the stats of the Onslaught. That's probably more what you're alluding to, too. Um, you want to see, like, what... What's more possible? Um, those those are the stats right there. Give everyone a second. Kind of see my strategy for this. Um, I was, you know, more with a stun build, but I'm like, well, the dragons don't get stunned. They don't get knocked back. So if I'm going to be taking on dragons, what matters is your attacks per second and then your pure damage, right? So... With the, what is it, the Chesterfield, I was getting like 59 or 60 damage with the headshots. So this Onslaught's significantly stronger. So um, it's the same ammo type too. So keep that in mind. But yeah, good questions. So thank you. Um, we're going to continue. Let's just sort everything here. Yeah, let's uh, continue. Uh, okay, I didn't get hurt. Okay, cool.
So we're going to um, resume. Let's just finish this third floor real quick. I took out twins, and I think we were just going to keep moving on here. Okay, we got two more doors on this uh, hallway. Thought I saw that zombie. Always got to make sure they don't come from your blind side. We'll loot this real quick. Okay, we got to rare this. Hey, what's up? Uh, what's up there, uncle? <laughs> Hello, what happens when you die in this game? Oh, we got Tendril. I'm level 20 and have avoided dying so far. Oh, wow. Hey, uh, congrats on that. That's that's really good. That's really good. Um you okay so when you when you when you die in the game you get a status here it says dying so you're gonna move a lot slower when you respawn you'll have to heal you'll be at like i think it's 25 health it'll cost you some to heal with meds obviously um but yeah that's the main thing you don't lose any of your stuff though and and you'll lose um you'll lose progress oh man that was just a quick shot um you'll lose progress with your xp like while you're out so what's important is i'll pass it what's important is uh one second Yeah, so what I was saying, like, what um, it's important while you're out uh, running around, when you, when you're completing, like, say, uh, like, you know, you've seen these zones, right? When you're in a purple zone, you get the XP and all that. Just go back if you, you just do it out of precaution. Just go back to the outpost, right? If you're like low on health, just go back to the outpost because if you do die out the field. You'll lose half that XP you gained, which if it's like a hundred thousand XP, you'll lose fifty K, right? So that can be I mean that can you know, that uh that can be a setback. That can you know, that might take you another what hour or whatever to get, depending on how long it took you to get the fifty K or whatever. So um yeah, good question though. Hey, what's up, League? I have a gun and dragon mask for lunar event, but I'm 47 i can't use oh <laughs> you'll get there you'll get there you're not that far far away from that <clears throat> i bought a uh what's that i bought a damaged um a damaged m4 that has uh Reduced find ammo chance. And I was so excited. Oh, yeah, this would be great, you know, for my other characters. Um, I go to equip it, and it's level 45, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> They're level 38, so I'm like, oh, whoops. <laughs> so, at least you have it, though. And, you know, from now until the end of the event, um, maybe you can craft even, you know, more of them, too. Like, that's what I did with my uh, my mask. I'll show you. Um, let me see. Okay, I think that's everything. I'll show you. Uh, ah, I see. Thank you. Great stream. Hey, um, yeah. Hey, thanks for stopping by. Uh, good question there. Good, good stuff, Uncle. Yep. Um... Yeah, uh, yeah, let's see here. What was I going to, um, oh, so yeah, I re, okay, so these are the stats for the mask that I crafted. This actually turned out very, very good. Um, some, some in the chat the other day, like when I crafted this, they're like, hey, yo, 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 you should, you should totally keep that one. 
because I had another uh, another one that wasn't as good. They're like, yeah, you keep this one. And you can see because pretty much everything is 50 or higher, except for find weapon chance, which that's fine. You know, that, that's fine with me, 49, you know what I mean? What matters to me is like the attack speed and, you know, the mutate and all that. So um, you can craft more of these. And if you want to try to get a better roll, it's possible. I I was fortunate enough to roll this one. So I don't have to worry about this anymore. Now I can focus on uh, the other the other stuff like the the pouches and whatnot. Hmm. All right. Cool, guys. So we're almost done here with the third floor. Let's uh, keep going. I have the info here for the lobby in the chat. Scroll up a bit. You guys want to join? Anyone wants to join? Take on some dragons, etc. I kill neon zombies, and some guy helped me with the gold and silver. Oh, that's good. <laughs> hey, you'll take it, right? Nice. Yeah, I mean, you're more than welcome to join up the server if you want to. I'm here. I'm just kind of running through PCA right now, but I'll probably be running uh, dragons here in a second. I'm just trying to earn enough. Oh, I hit E. I'm trying to earn enough cash to where I can enhance the uh, onslaught. And then I'll show you guys that and hopefully I get a good roll so you can see how that turns out. You know what? I'll be honest too, right guys? Um, the uh, I, I, These Neon zombies are kind of cool actually. Like, the Christmas ones, you know, it's the same thing, just a different, you know, skin, but, um, you know. Oh, he, like, slid. It just seems like these ones, like, the hit detection is a little bit better on them. Cool, but tough. Hey, what's up, Hammer? Hello. Thanks for the like there, guys. All right, appreciate it. We are running through PCA here real quick. Just trying to uh, get some loot before running and taking on the dragons again. The series was great, so I figured I'd run it another episode or two while we still got the event going on. Um... Yeah, it was actually the best video of to date, and, that, and that's because of you guys. You know, I'm just I'm just playing the game. But thank you guys for that. So, uh, we're gonna continue today. Um, yeah, we'll you know we'll try to get uh, this invitation here. Let's see, I'm hopeful, but you know I don't have the uh, find book stuff on, so I'm not really expecting to get it. Uh, it'd be cool if I did, because I've been searching for this for a month. Alright, say hello to Optic Fingerhead. Have fun in there. See you never. What's cool about doing this Drown Mine mission... Did you get access to the side room, which actually you can fight potentially another boss, so you get uh, another chance for a unique item too. Kind of cool. Oh, I got an elite. Nice. I 
it's too bad in the other room you don't have a uh there's nothing you can't search anything after you get the uh, comer's uh invoice or whatever that is so there's no real you know i'm not gonna waste my ammo i mean there is i guess there is a, a safe over there you could open the too risky. Too much going on. Okay. We're on the fourth floor out of the six. Running running PCA is really good for uh XP too good. Like uh I think since I've been here, since I've had two floors, I got 160,000 XP. It's actually pretty good. But yeah, um... So yeah, so Uncle there, um... If you, on the purple zones, if you run the Neon Zombies one, and you can, I mean, those are pretty decent for uh, XP. Keep that in mind for the future. Especially the Neon, the 20 Neon Zombie one. That's, uh, that's really good for XP. I've been adding that to my rotation, actually. Besides taking out the dragons, I I take out those zombie ones. Not not the five zombie, not the five envelope zombies, but the ten the ten envelope. There we go. You found some rice. Will you take it? It needs to say, you found Kate's eatery invitation. Will you take it? Sure. That's what it needs to say. Oh. <laughs> Want one. Maybe one of these days. Yeah, the 20 Neons are tough, but only five envelope ones I've seen so far. Yeah. Yeah, you'll you'll still get some XP for those though. I mean it's not not bad. And we got a couple books. I wasn't really expecting them. Um. Fuel, will you take it? Nah, I don't think the price of fuel is very much right now. Okay, so that should be the fourth. Or, oh, we got one more door. We got one more door, and we got two more floors, and then we're done with PCA. And then we will take on the dragon. Hmm. There's choir. <laughs> choir down. As I like to say. Why oh, shot? Elite, come on. Or unique. Oh, I did get you. I said elite and I got it. <laughs> Uh, 
I hear the zombie, I don't see. I've been so worried about dying. I thought I'd have to go get my stuff back. Good to know you don't lose anything, though. I'll be more brave. Yeah, um, well, thankfully, yeah, uh, yeah, no, I totally get it. Um, yeah, um, I guess the main thing with it is you got to heal again, you know, like you'll be, you'll have your, you have to heal, right? But you, you keep your stuff. So like if you loot something that's really good, I mean, you'll be able to keep that. But, um, you know, you'd ha you just have to heal back. All right. Um, I got a couple of these books. I'm just going to read real quick. Um, you know, keep your books. I, I just read them and discard them unless there's certain books. We'll get to that some other time. Like if they've got combinations, I keep them until I use the combination. Right. I just don't like my inventory being all like fluttered if I can help. That's all. That's all I care about. But, uh, okay, yeah, we're running out of space here. We do have a couple more items we can save up here. If anything, I'll use the, like, really cheap stuff if I need more space. We're running lower on ammo, too. I think... I don't think I can finish PCA with what I got. I think I can get through one more floor, though. So if I'm careful with my ammo, I think we can get through one more floor. Let's go ahead and do that. We're going to go to the fifth floor. Oh, zombie right there. Blind spot. Maybe I'll get lucky and find some uh, ammo along the way. And what I'm gonna do, like in this case, just use just use the shotgun on those ones. I don't like these ones in close. Because if you if you miss your shot, you're kind of in a tough, even for like a seasoned veteran, it makes it more difficult than it needs to be. I try to keep that to a minimum if I. Can. Okay. Oh, didn't reload. Have have fun in there, guys. There we go. Hey, we got an enhancer and a black die. And we got a flak jacket. I'll say no to that. Cool. Um, probably... I think all I will need... Take a look. Oh, I, okay, I got one more item space. Ah, uh, these are what a hundred bucks, you know. All right, let's take a second. Is there anything here that's really not worth it? Probably the peanut butter. We can use up some of the shoddy ammo. Back, we can free up another inventory. 
I don't need the die. So, you know, we can just use it. Oh, they can't be combined. What? Why? Blue, though. Okay, whatever. Alright, so we do... Okay, we have a couple item spots open. We'll see. See how this goes. We got a couple more uh, doors. So, um, welcome everybody. Uh, for those just uh, tuning in here, we are running through PCA real quick. Um, I, I, what I try to do is I try to run uh, PCA after like an outpost, uh, or while well, during an outpost defense. So. Um, or at least I make progress in that in that regard. Yo, what's up, crab? Yeah, welcome. Hey, uh, crab, I sent you a uh, a trade, by the way. If you if you want it, let me know. Okay, so we're going to wrap up the fifth floor here. Thanks for the info. Going to go back playing the game, but I'll leave your stream on in the background. Have a great night. Hey, um, yo, hey, uncle there. So, hey, hey, thanks for stopping by. Uh, good questions. Uh, good luck with the character. I mean, that's actually really good. Um, you're level 20. You haven't really died. Yeah, you, know, you haven't died yet. So keep that going. Um, you know, any other questions? Ask any time. And uh, you know, if you haven't already done so, you know, feel free to subscribe if you want to. I usually post every day or most every day. Uh, so there's always something new to check out, especially when there's events going on. So, but uh, yeah, uh, good luck there, um, and hopefully you get a lot of good stuff. That's actually why I run this area, because yesterday I got a unique. Um, and Crab, oh yeah, so, yeah, you just joined. Yesterday I got a uh, a Dodger's Breast from PCA, and th those go for like 800k. <laughs> so that's why I'm kind of here too, because I was like, oh man, that was awesome. Because <laughs> I'm trying to get, you know, I need 100 more credits to enhance the uh, onslaught so i'm really kind of grinding for that you know all right so i gotta reload Just back them, back them off if you can. And then rifle. There you go. That's why I have a shotgun too, because you can knock them back and back them off of you, so you have more range to hit those longer shots. <clears throat> oh, I thought that that was crafting for a second. I was like, what? <laughs> You you found uh, you found buttons. Oh, hey! Don't have to tell me twice. I'll go to the market and sell those. <laughs> I did find a cotton thread earlier. That, that. Oh, I thought that was a regular zombie for a second. I was like, what? Oh, by the way, it's not. <laughs> Not a regular one. Elite. Or, um, unique. I keep mixing those. No. I won't take 
I'm playing around with the chainsaw build. Man, it's satisfying taking out bosses with chainsaw. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I know some people, they, they have like the... What is that, like a... Uh, stealth, like a low visibility, or no visibility, or like a low visibility chainsaw build. That's cool. All right, running out of room. We got one more slot, basically. Unless I find eight millimeter rounds, which, you know, you never know. Shotgun and rifle. Best friends of looter. Yeah. Yup, exactly. Exactly. That's that's how I've that's how I've been with how it's been for me with any game I've played. You, you know, you can go back and see, you know, Gears of War, Call of Duty. I always ran uh, a shotgun some kind of with those games. So this isn't like a new this isn't new for me. I figure if I if I've spent time trying to get acclimated to a weapon, I mean, I may as well, you know, stick with that. That's kind of what I'm, how I, 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 you know, I don't mind trying the other, you know, like, uh, you know, submachine gun or whatnot, but I, I've always been more of a shoddy player. Just how it's been for me. Yeah, and, and like in the Gears days, I would predominantly use the uh, the Nasher. But in a competitive game, I had to use the Lancer. I had to use the AR basically. You know? Like you got, I had you have to be balanced too. So it's like having that long range and having that short range. You know, whether it's melee or something, you got to have you know I think a balance to really. Because you know, not not every situation is going to be the same. Like you know, not every not every fight's going to be you know close or you know different. Oh, hysteric! Hysteric! Did I get it? I think I got it. Hey, I got it. Wow. Okay, good. <laughs> Sledgehammer. Maybe I do have enough ammo to finish this. I'm cutting it close, I think. In case I run into choir. Okay, we have a spitter that's right here. Okay, and one thing is make sure you look away from the door when you're trying to loot. So you don't accidentally hit to, you know, go through the door instead of loot. Because then you lose that opportunity. Right? Something different, exactly. There's choir.
fire down. I'm on top of the world. I just choir again. Choir down again. A medic bag, we will take that. Uh what else could we what else could we part with? I think that's fair, right? We got a medic bag, which is worth like what three K? So that that we gotta take that. Um Okay. And any any like stackable med that just you know like you know bandages and whatnot, I just kind of uh I pre use those just cause, you know, I'm not gonna have a separate stack for those. Unless they're like painkillers, it, then then I would more more any you know morphine right. Uh, those meds right, but not not just the basic one. I've been getting a lot of regular nine millimeter. I need rifle nine millimeter. <laughs> I'll take that. I realized late that it was an acid one. That, that kind of annoys me because I, I knew I knew I could have played that differently. I take nonsense damage from that. That's what I meant to do. All right, we're still good. So let's see what we get. You all. Alright, we got two more rooms. Two more rooms to go. Hopefully I find a couple more bosses. Like, two more bosses. Heard one more something in there. It's a hysteric. All right, you know what? I'm I get tired of these. Actually, I'm just gonna go to it. Okay, good. We got the painkiller. Mm. Nope. <laughs> All right, one second, guys. We uh, let me heal here. All right, one second.
All right, we got one more room well, in here, and then we have one more room after. I was hoping it would have been engage. All right, here we go. I got a neon zombie. And they give a lot of XP in this building, too. Oh, there we go. One K hype, rats. Hey, thank you. Thanks, bro. Yes, absolutely. That was uh, I mean, that's been a uh, that's that was awesome. That was kind of crazy, right? Magnum rounds. If they were worth something, I'd pick them up. Uh, I think that's it, except for... Let's see what we get from Choir. A rare hockey helmet. I mean, I may as well take it. Well, we had enough ammo, barely. But I'm going to need to get some at the market. Oh, may as well do that. All right, so we are through with PCA. Got some stuff, you know, I guess, you know, I don't know, 30K, 40K worth. I guess we'll see. And maybe a little more because some of the meds are a little bit. But uh, we will go ahead and take on the dragon here in just a bit. I just got to get more ammo. And with the prices of uh, 9mm right now. No. Alright. As much as I want to just run there now, I'm just going to go to the outpost because I need to get more ammo. You know, if you're in doubt, like if you have like one, like a one or two ammo stacks, like really, really just to be on the safe side, depending on if you want to keep running purple zones, probably have, you know, a few more. I'm probably going to, oh, I'm going to definitely buy some more of the shoddy too. But... There's no way that hit me from that far away. That's ridiculous. I was way over from that. What? what? I don't know. I think... I don't know. Did they did they increase the range? Like, did they do some kind of stealth update with uh, the acid... Uh, like, the zombie breath? Because it's like... That used to never hit me, like, I don't know, it's weird. That would used to be like, uh, I'm getting hit by that all the time now. I'm, I'm, I'm moving, I'm moving faster, I, I just don't understand. This seems a little odd to me. Maybe it's just the latency or something. All right. So any, anything? So hungry. Oh, we, we have a little bit of cash. I'm actually thinking... I gotta sell some of this stuff to get some cash to buy. 
to buy the uh, the ammo I'm gonna need. All right, so let's sell some stuff. Actually, I gotta free up some market slots. That would probably help. Hold on, I'm maxed on every. I'm literally maxed on everything. I'm probably gonna keep the. All right, that should be fine. So hungry. Okay, we should do well with selling this stuff. Okay. Yeah, my market's a little full. It, it is. Try. I'm trying to get some credits, you know. Oh yeah, so uh, yesterday this is what I got from PCA with the last run. They go normally they go for like eight nine hundred k, but I've I've lowered it just to you know they are a bit difficult to sell. So, <clears throat> so we'll just sell some of the stuff and then we're gonna buy some ammo. These pouches would have sold yesterday. I had them priced perfectly. They were like. They're like one or two K too high. That's the only downside. Oh, and one other thing. If you have a full uh, market trade lots, you can still scrap stuff. I, I could have been doing that too. You can still scrap stuff. Don't let that discourage you too much. Just, uh, you know, at least try to get this uh, part of that out of the way. Um, I'm just seeing if I got anything good. Just some scrap stuff. That's not bad. You know, and you also gotta account for if uh, other people it's like what would what would other players do would they buy this or there's always that element to it um okay we'll sell we'll sell some of these aid first aid kit i like to keep some with me though especially when i'm taking on the dragons though, which we will be here in just a moment just gonna sell some of this stuff make sure we have enough uh cash to do that i can probably get rid of that i don't i didn't i didn't actually find the safe well actually i think i found the safe but it was in that room with the optic uh fingerhead okay i guess i could pull some of this other stuff that's not I kind of had this stuff kind of just set so I could forget about it, but with my trades being near max, I'm, I'm going to just have to kind of sort that out real quick. All right. Lots of uh, kick stats on those trainers, I don't Okay. So yeah, let's get some ammo though. Move some of this stuff out of the way. I don't really use the medic bag, so I'm just gonna. Okay. All right. Oh. All right. So I'm gonna get. Three stacks of the 10 gauge, and then we'll get uh, like eight and a half of the nine mil. Let's just do that. Let's just do that. Hey, we should have enough uh, money now. 
We're gonna get some back by taking out the dragons anyways. Okay, this is really, really good. Okay, this is a great price for the... Too bad this wasn't the cost of the rifle. Wow. Like 5k a stack, isn't it? Basically. Okay. Buy what I can. You do not have enough money to buy this item. Yeah, I know. Trust me. I Let's get all this stuff sorted. All right. <laughs> Don't mind all these <laughs> antiseptic sprays, all this. This is market prep. Like, this is me preparing for uh, tomorrow's items. Don't mind that. <laughs> uh, it's going to be some of this stuff. I mean, you know, it's just anyone's guess of what it'll eventually be. Um. All right, so we're going to be taking on some dragons. So let me... <laughs> Figure out uh, what I want to bring with me. Obviously, not a million antiseptics. Do I have any storage space out in the car? Really, really getting out of hand. I should probably scale it back. You know, I don't think I do. <laughs> I could probably part with some of these dyes, though. Yeah, I don't need six. I think I think one's fine. At least I can put some of that stuff. Oh gosh. Maybe one of these days, right? Okay. So let me just set the map marker. Well actually these events are gonna rotate, so let's just take a minute. I hope it's chips tomorrow. <laughs> Hey, so crab. So crab. Honestly, hey, if it's chips tomorrow, I'm ready. <laughs> I am ready for 20k a chip bag. <laughs> I'm ready. In the off chance that they go against precedent and pick another item, I think they're going to pick peanut butter. I do. Because I, hey, the, the lunar kid, he wanted chocolate spread. I mean, you know what I mean? It's like right, very similar, like in the the sense of, you know, the item look and uh, you know, just similar concept, right? Um. Okay. Yeah, I, I that's crazy. All right, well, maybe I could bring some uh, meds with me. Cause we're gonna be out fighting the dragons a lot, so that's fine. We'll we'll we'll, we'll do that. Yeah, that's probably a good way to use. Give me one minute to sort. Oh, and I have soda here, too. I could probably part with... Yeah, because I, I find this stuff when I'm out and about anyway. We'll just do that. We'll just do that real quick. And just a reminder that I want to eventually sell these. You know. Okay. <laughs> and crab, this is just one character. I have all five characters are like that with with stuff. You'll die out there. I have a whole car. I have I have two whole cars of antiseptic spray. I know that's overkill, but if if I, if every Hey, if every one of these is going to be 10,000 tomorrow, I mean, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I absolutely. All right, so uh oh, I think I was going to sell some stuff. It's not safe here. Um 
And I, I was actually just, uh, I, I found these cotton threads. Uh, so, like, some of the stuff I'm finding, I am trying to sell it. Okay. So we'll just uh, handle this real quick, and then we're going to go take on some dragons. Everyone, you're more than welcome to, if you want to. Um, we got the lobby info up at the top there, if you scroll up to the top of the chat. Um, again... Try to take on the dragons as a group if you want. Um, I'm just getting things set up for later, uh, the market run. I'm glad because today, uh, today it was chocolate spread and I had like, I don't know, 10 of them. So they, they're like 20k now. Just for context on that. That that's why I did that. I I, I guessed right, but you know, it's like fifty fifty. Like I've gotten some of these days right and some. <laughs> okay. And you know I'm not really utilizing a lot of the space right now, so this is. Um, let's see. Welcome, everybody. Yeah, so we're about to take on the silver and gold dragons. I think that those zones just, uh, reset a couple minutes ago. So let me just, uh, I guess I could heal a little bit. That's fine. Okay. Try to get some more cash, cash back. Private trades. So yeah, crab, it, it gets better. I have chips in the outgoing too. So we're going to get ready to take the dragons on here. Just one second. Okay, yeah, so okay, soda's going up a little bit. I think they're gonna throw a curveball here, guys. I think that it it's possible it'll be diet soda one of the days. I can't imagine it's only gonna be soda every day. You know what I mean? I think one of these days it's gonna be something different. <laughs> so I mean these are what, fifty bucks? Maybe just buy like five of them just in case. You know what I mean? They're really cheap. I mean, for 50 bucks, like, why not? In my mind. Alright, let's go. Dragon hunting time. Alright. Let's take on the gold dragon first. Let me make sure here. Got all the usual buffs. I use the burns kit too preactively because you know when they when the dragon goes by you you can get on on fire you know you can get burned. I don't like those uh, debuffs. Okay. All right, guys, we're gonna be running to the dragon here. You see, if you see it, you know what I mean. Like I'm looking, I'm gonna be looking. Uh. Okay. I'm in the zone, so I have to refresh the zone. I have to refresh the zone. That's what I'm going to do. I got to pick a good... What's a good vantage point? We're going to... Uh, we'll loot this first. Oh, oh, it refreshed, it refreshed. Oh.
There you go. Hold down. Whew. That gets crazy, guys. If I can hit the knee in one. No, I'm not aiming for you. I'm not aiming for you. Go this way. Oh boy, that was uh, that was a bit of a fight there. Um, I got I took some damage, yeah. Yeah, that one. I didn't think. I didn't think that purple zone was gonna refresh. I thought I was gonna be able to enter a house and come back out. No. My panic resist. I'm just seeing if I have to use another one or not. Panic resist less than five minutes. I probably. Bandages, we can use those. They're free. Okay, holiday high. Stim okay. Alright. Just make sure you get all your buffs active before going into these zones. Remember, like I say, you know, anytime I see a Neon zombie that's in a high-level zone, I take them out. Absolutely anytime. I, I drop what I'm doing to take them out, because they're a couple thousand XP. Per hmm. Alright, we should be getting close to these purple ones, or these, the purple zone for these silver ones. Okay. So I gotta keep heading in the direction of the marker. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, that was close. That was actually really close. That one, that one was literally in my face. <laughs> yeah, that... That could have been that could have been bad, but we we are victorious. Oh, we'll take on some Neon zombies, sure. Let's let's go take on some Neon zombies. Ooh, antiseptic spray. Who knows? They might be like 8k tomorrow. Rare jeans. Probably not worth all that much, but... Oh, Stalker! Stalker! Yeah, because I don't have the music on. You Stalker. Hey, I'm gonna- I'm gonna complete this purple zone despite you, Stalker. You're not gonna deny me this. The trees are getting in my way more than you are.
Okay. Not gonna catch me. You can't catch me. Yeah, it, they'll just spawn it in front of me. That's what they'll do. You must be infinitely pursued until you evade it. It's like... Yeah, there you are. Oh, okay. Cool. I would like to know the reason, like, why they added Stalker to the game. I guess, I guess, did they think players weren't moving around enough? Or, like, you know what I mean? Like, what's the lot? Like, what was the... Like, I'm not challenging it, but it's just, like... It just doesn't... No, you should be able to kill like you should be able to take the stalker out like okay you get xp for evading it cool yeah but i think if you actually like if it had a you know a certain amount of health like a lot of health and you killed it then you get more xp that would be really i think that would be fine instead of it chasing you around to the end of the earth like i feel like you know, it would make more sense to have it have some finite amount of HP. Just just treat it as like a super boss. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, they did that in um, Resident Evil. They did that in the remake for Resident Evil 2. And it's like, you know, with, with Mr. X. And it's like, I'm sorry, you know, I don't. No. It just do, the game doesn't flow with that though. It just I don't know. You're you're focused on getting away from that instead of like the zombies, which is the point of the game, you know. Oh, we got some money now. Finally, those soft souls sold very good. Okay, we got a little bit of cash now. Good. We're halfway to the goal. We are halfway to the goal of getting the last hundred credits. You managed to escape the stalker. Hey, there we go. We got some XP. Nice. Nice. I, I, I do appreciate the XP. So I'm cool with that. I don't think it should follow you around for five whole minutes, though. I think that's a bit that's a bit much. I I think I think like one or two minutes is you know, like that's plenty fun. God. Alright, so, um, we sold one soft soul, so we're gonna sell another one. I usually have one on deck for that reason. This world's gone to I just gotta check the current price. I do all this stuff while I'm out doing the purple zones, so that kind of AFK sell. Alright, so you see these are going for like 328k. I I discount them pretty good. No, I'm I'm pretty fair with it. I think we'll go two. What is it? Uh, two eighty four. I just throw some random numbers in there. That's like what forty something k savings. I mean, you know what I mean. <laughs> hit scrap that was weird okay saving up these envelopes okay guys so that was that was a success we um pick out those dragons on that first uh, run through let me just take a minute here and figure out what i'm working with okay all right, so we got, okay. <coughs> hey, let me check the price of these. What can I do for you? What can you do for us, trader? What could we do for you? Do you need anything? <coughs> oh, these uh, howling pouches are starting to go. These were like 6K or what, 8K, and now they're like 30. I think, I think there's like, you know, like I've told you guys before, there's like a group that kind of focuses on one item at a time. They started with festive badges and now they're kind of working down. They were buying up all the snow, 
hunter pouches and then now they're leaving these alone because they're basically already you know they're not gonna buy those because of these right but after the after the event you better you better bet this all this stuff's gonna go up again okay so we're what 60k mm. trying to do the math in my head so i'll net like 51k of free huh? Yeah, I can. I can do that. This will be what, like two hundred k, basically. I can I can craft two more. You actually think you can survive up there? We know we can survive. We we have a can do attitude. Can't really go lower on a lot of this other stuff. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, we'll just take a second here and uh then we're gonna continue taking on the dragon. I just gotta get this stuff sorted out in the market here. I'm just trying to decide because like some of these uniques I mean they they're 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 good but they don't they don't really sell no. Some of this stuff does not sell on right now. You want to sell the stuff that is and then kind of wait for the other stuff. All right, that should help a little. Okay. Yeah, we're 100 credits away from the 500 we'll need. Well, we're 90 credits away, but I don't think I'm going to find 90 in a bunch. That's about 600k cash away. So we have that with what's in the market. It just stuff's not quite selling. Just a matter of time, though. All right. Let's. We'll just price the rest of this stuff. Let me just see about these photos real quick. For us. <coughs> okay, so they were two k, what thirty minutes ago. That 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 price is gonna go like this all all until, you know, the reset. I wouldn't read too far into that. Uh, really, what we want to look at is food. We want to see what the foods do. I am so glad I bought... I bought, like, ten of these yesterday, guys. I had a thought in my mind. I'm like, wait, you know... Chocolate bar, chocolate spread. Yeah. So I, I bought, like, ten of these yesterday, and they were, like, 400 bucks each. It was a good thing I did that. Okay. Okay, so the chip the chips are starting to go up. Chips are starting to go up, guys. They were like two like twenty five hundred earlier, so they've doubled in price. Chocolate bars are down ten K from the other day. If it were me and I was buying items right now, guys, I don't know. I think I think you buy uh well, you gotta think. There's six days left to go for the event. The Lunar Kid has a five item rotation. So, candy, chips, chocolate bar, chocolate spread, and soda. So you have a 20% chance, if you focus on one item, of getting it right. 
it's already chocolate spread, so what's the likelihood it'll be that again tomorrow? You know? I think it's going to be chips. That's my opinion. I think it'll be chips. So, anyways. Uh, enough of that. So, um, we'll just kind of have this stuff for now. I don't know where else to put it because I literally don't have any more rooms. We're going to take on some more dragons. And what's good with that too, guys, is um, you get a lot of XP for taking on the dragons. Oh, nice. Okay, those 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 sold. Okay, okay good. Um, oh, sweet. We can get these dragon ones back to back. Oh, awesome. Okay. Let's uh, let's head there now. Let me uh, double back. Oh, I should. I'll oh, I'll heal a little. bit. Before we go into battle, just make sure you know you get the the heal. You, know, you got your everything accounted for with the heal. Okay. All right, and uh, reload. Don't do like I did the one battle where I didn't reload, and then I was running into a dragon. <laughs> All right. So yeah, just just make those market preparations now because in what five hours and well five hours twenty minutes well, five eighteen that it's going to be a new rotation of uh, you know mission items. Sometimes they keep them the same, but I think there's going to be a few that change. And they might they might break precedent and they might do all kinds of stuff. I think the last day of the event's going to be crazy. I don't know what they're going to do with that. I wouldn't be surprised if it was something totally different. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, it didn't count. No, I thought I got it in time. That sucks. I gotta find another. Uh, this this zone's particular. I gotta focus. Um, I gotta be in more. I gotta be in more. We gotta go this. That sucks. Yeah, you gotta watch that too. See if I can loot that. Uh, well, okay, we took some damage. We're all right. Let's set course for the gold, because that was, like, pretty much, like, on the way to the gold one anyway, you know? Hmm. Okay, maybe I can... Maybe I can low-key... Can I loot this? All right, we're going to go... Is this the last house until... Probably, this is probably. Okay, this is the last house. I Let's go in here. I'm going to make sure I have enough uh, health and all that. Um, that's probably... Uh, all right, we're still good on that. He just... Oh, nice. Gold dragon, so gotta be on our A game here. And that pile's gonna throw me off because it's on fire. I think it's behind me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
go. Alright, Neon Zombie, you're next. No. Come on. I shot through you. I'll take the extra XP. <laughs> okay, that was a success. Now I just gotta get back to civilization here. Oh, I got the whole world chasing. Got the whole zombie crowd chasing me. We're gonna go... Go this way. Would have tried, but And we made it back. Well, that was successful. <laughs> nice. Okay, we got some more envelopes. And, uh, got some stuff we can sell. You'll die in here. He said we'll die in here. But this is an outpost, sure. You're not convinced that the, like, three guards can protect this whole building? Why not? Okay. We're 2 million XP away from another Elite Enhancer. And we got 10 minutes on the... Purple Zones. Is there a Neons? Oh, they're right by... You know, they're right by each other if I go to Haverbrook. Yeah, if I go to Haverbrook, I mean... May as well run these rules. I'm going to pick this street because there's an overlap here. So just keep going down the same street to get to the other one. And I think I'll use my shoddy rounds for these. Just not to waste the uh, rifle run. I don't need, you know, I don't know. I don't need the rifle here. I'd probably complete it a little faster, but...
<laughs> Double headshot. Wow. I'm right here. And we're done. All right, nice. We ran all the purple zones on that one. May as well just go back to um, Haverbrook. I wish you could, like, stealth take down these zombies. You get, like, bonus XP for, like, a stealth takedown. That'd be cool. the tr what can i do for you what can you do for us what can we do for you you need you need ammo you need meds i need more inventory space can you cut me a deal on this uh, inventory bundle no Got some more of those 
enveloped, and we got another rare enhancer. Okay. We, we do have a bit of room. Okay. That's cool. Pouches of endless luck sold. Hey, nice. There we go. I don't think I'd pay 885, but this gives you an idea. We're about a little less than halfway left to the last hundred we'll need to to craft the uh, enhanced dragon onslaught. That's what I'm looking to uh, craft here. Hundred hundred credits away. Well, ninety credits away, but I mean, practically speaking, I bought ten on accident. I thought it was a hundred. I thought it was like a a deal. Like I, you know, it was like ten for eighty eight k, and I was like, wait. I thought it was a mispriced one hundred. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to be working towards. And then once I once I craft this, I mean, I've crafted everything else. I got I got a good roll on a mask. It's just gonna be saving the. Uh, envelopes for the elite enhancers and pouches. That's what I'm going to be focusing on once I get the onslaught. But uh, welcome, everybody. So uh, if you're just tuning in, uh, welcome, guys. I see a few, uh, a few of you are just joining now. Um, just to bring everyone up to speed, we are here in the lobby. If you'd like to... Um, if you scroll up in the chat just a little bit, you'll get the lobby info. We're in the lobby. Uh, you can join if you want to. We'll take on some dragons. We actually just got done doing that, but the zones just reset. So we're going to be back to running. Take on some more of the dragon. Let's get back to that. Um, let me just see... In. I guess it's not dire that I sell this stuff right now. So let's head back out and we're going to go to the... We'll go silver dragons and then we'll go um, gold dragons. Uh, thanks for the likes, uh, by the way. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Okay, cool. So... I have to go back and... This was just a reminder. I need to do that salvage. I'll get some extra XP for that too. I just, I need to do that once I'm done with the purple zones before the next rotation. Oh, those pouches are starting to sell. I'm losing about 10k, but I'm, I'm selling them now because I really want to get those credits. I can craft two more of them, so that'd be that'd be 100k net. So I guess you know that's the silver lining there. But all right. So how are you guys doing on this event? Has this been uh, something that, you know, has, has this been the kind of event you're liking to, to run or kind of disappointed? Or what are your guys' thoughts on this event uh, thus far? Uh, me personally, 
I think it's pretty good. Um, there's some stuff that's kind of meh about it, but there's some really fun, cool stuff about it, though, too. I'd say it's somewhere like at a, an 8, maybe, for, like, the uh, overall. Oh, here we go. Dragon, dragon, dragon. Um, I'm not ready, actually. I have my buffs up. Yeah, I got panicked. I wasn't paying attention. I gotta get out. Um, one second. Yeah, I mean, I think the dragons are cool. I think the dragons are cool. Um. Just use some random med, dude. Um, the neon zombies are really cool. Neon zombies are, I think, really funny. The dragons are cool. I think the market stuff's kind of interesting. What's happening with all these item prices? I don't know that it's a really good thing for the common play, like the, like a newer player, like the someone that's just kind of getting into the game. Like w what's happening? You know, I think that kind of causes confusion. But don't let that bother you, because I mean that stuff happens in these games. You know, um, that's that's at least my take on it. Okay, I see the one dragon. I have enough time to reload and kill it, I think. Okay, good. That other one's gonna hit me with panic. Oh, not panic. Oh, no, it didn't. There we go. Silver dragons down. They opened. They got a crusader sword. That's quite the. Uh, pretty cool. Yeah, crus. All right, let's set course for the gold dragon. That's like half a mile away. No, seriously, it's like half a mile. We're gonna really get the. Uh, movement going like we're gonna really get the steps in today. oh god crab says one good thing is that the dragons are unique enemies instead of a normal boss with a dragon mask oh i know oh i know right exactly yeah like uh like like the wendigo <laughs> basically <laughs> basically like the wendigo <laughs> I had nothing. I had nothing against it. I thought the Wendigo was actually okay, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I I totally get what you're saying there. I agree with that. Yeah. I'm, I'm, my, I think my main disappointment, the one thing I would say, specific to the event, is that there's not like a central location where you can battle other, like, lunar event themed stuff. Like, other, other boss. The dragons and the neon zombies are great. I think this works, but I was kind of thinking or hoping for maybe a little bit more in terms of uh enemy like enemies to 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 fight right but i don't know you know what those would be i i don't you know i was thinking something along the lines of maybe like uh you've got your zombie you got your dragon and then you have not a factory, but like a, I don't know, like a like a building where you would just kind of like a PCA or something. But maybe they didn't have the time to develop all that out, and maybe they just had to run with what they had. You know, I don't know. So I give them the benefit of the doubt there. I'm not bothered by it. I just was a bit disappointed there wasn't a bit more like a bit more enemies to take on, but it's fine. You know. Oh, and one other thing, 
guys, when you're getting into these fights against these dragons, you don't want to get to hit with the uh, bacterial debuff because that that slows you down 10%. That's actually a big deal. That happened to me, and I almost died earlier because I was like, wait, why am I so slow? And it's because of that debuff. So I'm, I'm like pre-using antibiotics against the gold one. Because sometimes, you know, you get hit by that. Not from the dragon, but from the zombie. Alright, we should be here. Okay, yeah. Alright, we're running into danger here. I hear it behind me. Oh, no. God's too soon. Maybe it'll get stuck by the... Oh, it is. Okay, good. I bought me some time. Gotta reload, and I'm gonna have to dodge. Here's... Okay, good. It's having a little trouble with this. I was hoping that counted. I was like, uh, but yeah, I was, I was in the zone. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Good thing I was. Uh, we'll take a base file. We need to get back to civilization now. We took them out. Let me take on this zombie. Welcome, everybody. All right, so we were just taking on the gold dragon. Took a bit of damage, but we got the job done. Armor is still holding up. We're going to head back to the outpost and reset here. Like I've been saying, anytime I see a Neon zombie, I take them out for that extra XP. Dead Frontier. Hey. What's going on? De Dead Frontier. Check out the game Haven and Hearth. Oh, I've never heard of that before. Is it any good? And, uh, welcome, by the way. There we go, that's how it's done, guys. Okay, so we sold the pouches. Okay, that's really good. That's like 156k, about... No, no, not 156, 151.5. Okay, we're about 350k away from getting this uh, enhanced Dragon Onslaught, guys. We are getting really close. So, I'm gonna craft, I'm just gonna craft, well, let's repair the armor first. I'm gonna craft, what, two of these? Yeah, we can make two of them. We still got 104 envelopes left. Alrighty. Uh -huh. What's up, trader? Let's sell some stuff.
All right. And if you're wondering why I have all these antiseptic sprays, I think I think the uh, next reset item <sighs> is going to be for medical. I think it's going to be antiseptic. Um, I think one of the next six days, I think it will be one of these items at least one more time. I'm kind of just preparing in advance before all the uh, the market buyers buy this stuff up. Because you know that's going to happen. I think it already is happening. Can this go on? Okay, yeah, they're starting. They're starting to work their magic, guys. They're starting to. They're starting to buy this stuff up. Okay. The yeah, because these were like three fifty earlier. Yep. So that's why I have all these. Because um, they were at their at their height, they were selling for ten thousand each. That's that's why I bought some. Because I think that that's going to happen again. Let's take a look at the other categories here, and then we'll go take on some more drag. Okay, so the chocolate bar and the candy is pretty even. Well, these are all pretty even. This is what the market is going to do when when people are trying to guess what it's going to be. If everything's the same price, then you can't really get it wrong because it's all the same. So that's what that's what they're trying to do. You, you, you know, you don't it, it eliminates the guesswork because it's like, OK, well, if I pay 6K, it's going to be one of the three things anyways. But yeah, this is um, if you have any chocolate spreads, I would say now's the time to just sell those you'll be you'll be rich quick look at that so if you find a chocolate spread i would sell it tonight because i don't i just i don't think it's going to be chocolate spread again i think it's going to be you know others like chocolate bar maybe but i don't think it's going to be chocolate spread again unless they unless they repeat it tomorrow which okay fine but if you find one i mean that's great cash right i would i would definitely consider it so don't use it. Don't don't use it. Sell it. Um, I'm gonna guess soda is already three k. Let Let's see. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even. Oh, I got that right on the money too. That guess was literally off the cuff. I didn't. I didn't see this in advance. I was like, oh, soda is gonna be three k. And <laughs> soda's three k. <laughs> That's why I have a couple of those as well. Ten dollar whiskey. Hey, I I honestly think they're gonna they're gonna throw a curveball here with one of these days. They're gonna either pick diet soda. They're gonna do something different. I think on the last day they're gonna do something different. I I you know what I mean. I have an, an uh, like an eerie feeling about that. But uh, okay, we'll go check one more thing here, guys. Okay, cloth. Okay, yeah. So cloth is up. 5k since I last packed. So there, okay, so the the market is betting on needles or cloth being the next uh, grandmother quest. And I I agree with that. I think that's possible. Huh? <laughs> the kid needs a salad. <laughs> <laughs> oh 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 no can i get 800k hey if i get 800k i can get those right now but i don't know if stuff's gonna sell in time did i just lower the price of the soft soul that's a really good deal that's a really good really 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 good deal on credits want to Get those, but I don't know. Someone's gonna beat me to that. Dang it. We still got two minutes left on the purple zones, anyways. I got, I think I got a heal too. Let me. Oh, uh, okay. The armor is all good. Let me. Well, I've got this all in mind. I mean, I may as well just use two of them. 
That's fine. Not a big deal. Hmm, okay. Yeah, so just, just in case it's chipped, I do have a little bit. And when I say a little bit, I have a lot. <laughs> I'm preparing for, uh, what? The five hours from now? Yeah, the kid needs a salad. Yeah, I mean, you know. It'd be so funny if one of the dialogues from the, the, the lunar mother, like the mom, if she was like, when when the kid asks for something, she'd be like, no, you can't have it. Like, uh, wouldn't that be like such a troll thing if they did like, uh, the kid wants, uh, I don't know, let's just say a quick example. Uh, welcome everybody, by the way. Let's just say the kid, oh, hey, I want candy. And then the lunar mom's like, no, you can't have it. And then you can't do that one or something like you can do it. But like you got to you got to give them to her. I don't know. You know what I mean? <laughs> that'd be so that'd be funny. Like you, you're not allowed to have any more candy. <laughs> a four, a four, can, four bar, candy bars is too much. <laughs> you're only allowed one. But yeah, guys, we're right. We're trying to work it towards this dragon's onslaught, the enhanced. And then I guess I can make the gameplay on the enhanced one instead. Um, you can compare the stats on the right there. Uh, I will get more headshot damage, so that is a good thing. And also, more damage versus mutated, which is what we really care about. Chip and shop only cost... Yeah, chip and shop only cost a buck, and chip in here... Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> What's up, Q? Yeah, um, yeah real quick. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. Yeah. These are um the the finest quality Doritos. The only the only the finest off the off the line here. But yeah, no guys, if you get chocolate spread, if you find chocolate spread, they're still selling for fifteen thousand. <laughs> you know. I would recommend you just sell them because I, I don't think it's going to be chocolate spread again. We got what, six days to go? It could be, but I would take the money now. Like, while it's 15000 I would take that now. You know what I mean? So, if you find one in a random, you know, desk or something, just sell it. And then you can, like, buy uh, something pretty good with that. But, uh, all right. Very good, guys. So we, uh, let's check one more thing. I gotta, I gotta get some more. The sodas are holding at 3k. Okay. Um, gotta buy the usual stuff here. And, uh, let me just check something else here. Okay. Buy some of them. <laughs> Last birthday cakes are 61.5k. <coughs> yeah. The... I'm just curious, what are the meds going for? Yup. Alright guys, great. Let's see, so... We're going to run the next, uh... Purple zones here, let me just, uh... Okay, we've got the gold dragon, we've got the silver one, we've got the neon zombies. We'll probably run all three of those, because these ones, I mean, it's it's in the corner up there. You know what I mean? And it's only, what, 2,000 All right, so I guess we'll go to the gold one first. Let me make sure I have everything. 
All right, cool. All right, I'm cool with that. All right, let's. Go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like <laughs> soda. Soda's like you know a, a buck, and then the in-game soda's like three thousand dollars. I don't know. In my mind, I mean, they had. I mean. Guys, they had to know that this was gonna happen, right? Like how, like how do you have quests and not exp You know what I mean? Like, if it were like you know, if I had one suggestion, I would have just said, well, if you have a couple item ones, I think that's cool. I think that's great. I think it would also be great to have uh, a couple like mission ones like take out dragons or something i don't know oh i thought that was a fingerhead for a second <laughs> i thought that was a finger fingerhead first all right moving a little slow here get Oh. Yeah, I was like caught off guard. <clears throat> Where can I find the unique key, bro? Um, hey, good question. So you have to find it's called a broken key, and then you go to the workbench and you have to uh, to craft it into a um, unique key. However, uh, I wouldn't recommend um doing that but that said that would be how you would do it though if you wanted to i have a bad feeling about this i can't see the drag where is it it sounds like it's right behind Yo, that, that dragon was not there. Got it. Oh my gosh. That was crazy. Whew. That was that was a fight. That was a fight right there. I need a second after that one. Boy. I think I might try a few gotcha crates slowly. <laughs> Well, I opened up, I opened one of those unique ones, and uh, I got, I got an, a unique that was like uh, 20k. There's a risk of you getting something that isn't really good. The good side of it is you could get something that's very good, so it's kind of like, I don't know. My advice would be not to, not to invest into it until you have like everything else kind of uh figured out like un until you have your character more set where you want to be i wouldn't do anything with the keys now if you get a broken key what i would do is you could just sell that in the market for like 10k and that's that's a lot of you know that's decent cash and then 
you could uh, use that cash to get something that's okay. Just just an idea, right? Okay. Yeah, good question. What? Um. Yeah, I. You know, I. And the the funny thing about that Q was uh. When I when I was starting to get back onto this game, it was what a couple months ago now. I think if you guys go back and see the videos, whenever I posted the first video, the uh, rifle build, um, I would ask in the lobby, like I would ask players, like, oh hey, hey guys, uh, how do you how do you get unique keys? And I'd be ignored, and I'm like, okay. Uh, I mean, I don't know if it was because I was a low level or they thought I was a noob or what, but I was just I was just like. Because that update app that update happened after I had stopped playing for a little while, so I was like, I didn't know what I you know I didn't know what they you know what that was about. So I was excited about it. I was like, oh, this is cool! Wow, you know what is this? You know, did I find like a a rare chest that no you know what I mean? But yeah, the thing about it is, you can't trade the stuff you get. Me. That's what I'm saying. Like lately, I've been getting hit by. It seems like they're so far away, and I'm getting hit. Like I don't know what's hit. But anyways, um, yeah. So I was like, oh well, this would be a great way to make money, you know? Like this would be a great way to make make cash because, like, oh oh my gosh, you know, I can make a mill. Like I can make a lot of money doing this. But you can't trade this stuff. So if you if you get reckless raider stuff, well, if like that would be awesome. But like, if you got that, like you couldn't trade it if you wanted to, unless you got it from like a boss. You know, like if you get it from a chest, then you can't. Unfortunately, I th I I don't. That's one thing I would I would hope that they wouldn't have had that in a game like that I think everything should have some sort of trade um, number maybe you make it one trade because I remember reading the patch notes and I was like oh okay because they they did that because of they, they said in the patch notes at that time they're like oh we did this because of inflation which I totally agree with I know that that's a problem this isn't the only game with that's had an inflation problem. But if you can't trade this stuff, I don't see how that solves inflation. I, I think it actually goes the opposite. Because there's no outlet for that stuff. You can't you can't trade it. So, like the the few that are in existence, the you know, the buyers can just hoard them up and mark the price whatever they want. When we get back to the... When we get back to the outpost, I'll show you what I mean. I know it's a well-intentioned idea. I think it's a good... I, I, I think it's cool. I would like to get a unique key from a boss. That'd be my opinion. If, if I got a unique key from a boss... And then I could pick a chest and open that myself. That's more interaction with the game. In my, I think you could either way, but not my call. I'm just I'm just a player, you know. But I'll show you what I mean, though. We'll run through these neon zombies. Um, really, if I were to open a unique chess and if i were to get something my ideal like like i guess like scenario would be uh reckless raider like reckless raider stuff or the and or huh, the uh fat man sweatshirt or the fat man's in fourth you know Yeah, good questions, guys. Good stuff. Hope everyone doing well today.
Just trying to get enough credits to where I can get that Dragon Onslaught, the enhanced one. One other thing I thought would be really cool for um, for PvP, it would be really cool if you could like duel outside in this courtyard or something. That would be really interesting, I think. <laughs> That have like a, a like a map like you have the killing grounds but have like a map that's like mansion or I don't know you know is there a developer among you who likes tentacles I see almost high boss and zombies have them yeah uh, there's a lot of the yeah they have the tentacle I don't know what's up with that those zombies kind of annoy me, to be honest. I get, like, hit from so far away from that. The tentacle doesn't even appear to hit my character model, and I'm, I'm like, stunned from it. I get what they're trying to do. Hey, what's up, Myth? What's going on? We are running through some... Purple zones right now. And maybe we'll get some good loot too. Or not. <laughs> Had to try. Thanks for the like. Appreciate it, guys. Alright. Appreciate it. Okay, we're going to go back to Haverbrook. We've got, what, uh, six minutes left? And like I, like I always say, anytime I see the Neon Zombie, I take him out. Every time. Every time. Unless they're in a low level zone. Each, each kill can be a couple thousand XP. So even though I'm already I'm max prestiged, right? For right now. What I'm trying to do is kind of use leveling up as a way to make money in the market. I buy weapons that are like, you know, rare. And then I use elite enhancers on them to try to get really good rolls and sell that stuff for, you know, good cash. All right. We made it back. Let's see what we sold. I'm surprised those soft souls haven't sold. I put them like 50k under the market. Uh, I gotta check. Hi. Boy. Oh, this is crafting. I think the next crafting item is going to be cloth. That's just my opinion. I think the next one is going to be. After that, I don't know. Um. Yeah, no, I'm I'm 60k under market. I'm probably a bit under. I might be losing money. Let me let me double check. What did I? What did I? So if these are all 20, let me just do a quick calculation. Mm. That's what, 177? But I actually think I paid 70 for the wax thread. So that would be, what, 182? The market's going to take a cut as well. So if it, tell, if it sells for 270, that's... A 38k, let's just say. 232. Okay, that is still profit, but. Okay. Just hoping it sells because I wanted to buy these credits. Oh, they're gone. They're gone. No. There was credits in here for 800,000. 
Oh, man. That would have saved me some money. Somebody, somebody sniped those. I knew that's what was going to happen. That's why I was trying to, like, quick sell some of that stuff. Okay, we got only the finest chips here at 5,500. Okay, chocolate spreads are about... They're, they're almost 16... 16,000. Doesn't this look weird seeing this, guys? You see, like, all these low prices, then you see this, like, out of the blue. Like, what? what is this? They, they had to know that this was going to be, like, inflation. You know what I mean? Like, they had to know, right? I kind of think there's, like, a, a strategy. For, like, they're trying to do something with this. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't know. It just seems odd. Cool. All right, cool, guys. So that was great. So I was just seeing if anything sold real quick. Um, and we still have a minute. I didn't think there was much point to finishing that other... Okay. Do some uh, inventory management. Here. We can sell some stuff. Uh, I don't really use those files. Okay. Got a little bit of ammo. Kind of running low on that, too. Bummer, man. We'll figure it out. We'll, we'll do another rotation and then see what else I can do here. Oh, that's what I was going to do. That's what I was going to do. I was going to... Uh, okay, we're going to go to... Um, we're going to go to Greywood for a second. I need to go there. I need to finish a mission real quick. Alright, uh, let me see. Put some of this stuff away. Yeah, it doesn't really matter, right? Okay. Alright, cool. So let's, uh... Oh, we're... Okay, we need, what, 40 more envelopes to make another one of those, uh... Pouches. Okay, that'll be another, what, 50, okay? Alright, cool. Let's, uh... Let's see here. I need... Oh, okay, I have enough inventory. We need 14 more... Oh, I actually got to be careful. You know, just to be on the safe side, let me put this damaged one away. You can see what I was talking about here. Oh, I don't know if you guys noticed this. You guys ever noticed this with the, with damaged stuff? There's no trade limit, I don't think. You see how underneath, like, the elite, elite there in the middle there, that gun I have? It says trades remaining too. I don't think there's a trade limit on damaged stuff. I just noticed that. I actually don't think there is. Unless there is, but it doesn't show that there is. Kind of, kind of a miscellaneous fact. <clears throat> so. I'm thinking those event pouches are going to get even more... They're going to get more expensive. They will. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. You know. they. I had mine priced for like 70k yesterday. I was 2k over what they were selling for. Apparently, like I, I priced them in advance. I kind of guessed what they were going to be at the, you know, the reset time. I was a little bit high in my estimate and mine didn't sell. But they were selling for about 70 at that point. So that's what another like 10k each for each one. I sold like four of them today, five of them. So that'd be another what 50k just from like guessing something at a correct time. You know, you never know in this. 
Okay, so let's, uh, oh, okay. Let me just put that away. Yeah, so I was, I was testing something, guys, um, with my other characters real quick. So, like, with your other characters, if you have characters that are kind of like storage, like food storage or medic store, med storage or whatever, I run that family residence with those characters <laughs> with all the gear that's like minus find ammo chance because you know acp ammo 556 caliber rifle and then the 20 gauge shotgun all those ammo prices are super cheap basically not worth picking up right i have my minus find ammo chance at a hundred and something percent the only problem is this level's 45 to equip this so i don't quite get that but anyways, I found that I was finding like more like soda, like more other things like chips and stuff. Kind of cool. I think that's actually the play. Um, when you go in that building, you don't want any ammo because it's all cheap anyways at, at level one. OK, so we need to get more um, damaged vehicle parts. That's what I was going to do. Actually Quick detour, then we're going to run back to the uh, purple zones. I wanted to get this out of the way. All right, so the most I want to pay is 600. Let's see what we have. Oh, great. Okay. We'll go um 560. Okay, I need 14. That's 9. Oh. Just gonna craft these real quick. I re I wish that there was a craft all like option or like craft X instead of having to get out of the menu fourteen times. I have to hit X every time I want to go craft them. Click click craft X. You know what I mean? But I'm doing this because there's a um, a mission for turning these in. So I want to get the... So it's kind of tedious, but when there's like downtime, and if I've already done the purple zones, I mean, in this case, I haven't. But like normally what I would do when there's downtime, I kind of do this on the side real quick to get extra uh, money and all. I mean, you kind of... You lose a little bit of money, but you get almost 40,000 XP for doing it. I mean, you know, it's kind of like a mini uh, family mission. If you... That's why That's why I do that. Kind of like, a, you know, another mission. All right, so we've got the... How many do I have? Okay, I got 15. All right, we just got to find, uh, we got to find Wendy. I think probably in these doors. Probably in here is my number one guest. Welcome, everybody. Oh, hey, hey, um, cool. You know what? We did another one, too. We did another quest. Yeah. We're going to get some cash, a premium coin, and some XP. Oh, yeah, because I took out 400 zombies that well good okay that one okay i was looking for that one too okay there we go hey i got the other one too we got we completed wendy's and then we completed uh tin tins right yeah because i do all those purple zones <laughs> so we got what 25 well like what 25k and like a hundred thousand hundred and what fifteen thousand xp or something like that took what five minutes you know what i mean so that's like another family mission basically and it's all right here in uh graywood right here <laughs> in the outpost free xp you'll die in here along with the Thanks, rest of us. hey if they were willing to give me some ammo for my trouble just you know just i get these premium coins which i just scrap so I actually never complete, I never have the requirements so I can 
perpetually farm those missions as long as I want. <laughs> That's how I'm doing that, guys. Okay. All right, cool. So let's take a look here. We still have some time. If we go to Haver, Brook, let's go to Haverbrook, and then I think we can go silver and then gold. I think that's the. We'll go. Let's see. Oh, so myth. If you've seen the uh, snow hunter pouches, have gone up in price too, right? They're like, they were like 240k the other day. Now they're now they're at 180, but they were they were 50 when the event started. If you guys have any of those, you should hold on to them. I would. Okay. Uh, let's... So yeah, we'll run through. We'll run through. Um, silver, and then we'll go to gold, uh, dragon. And then I will, on the next round, I'm gonna probably need to get some... The only sad part is this 9 mil is like 5k a... I'm saving up for these credits, so, like... I don't know. You're, you're kind of forced to... You want to use the weapon, you know. You gotta pay. You gotta pay the cost. I mean, this is probably no different than other events where you had other weapons on launch. They had other ammo types. It's just nine millimeter. I feel like it really hasn't had that happen to it. I remember buying them a stack of nine mil for like eight hundred bucks. Before, bef like, before the fat man. I don't think that will happen again. I think that ammo will permanently be above 1,500. In my opinion. You know, I just don't see. The Dragon Onslaught is too good for that to... I mean, it's not going to be 5k a stack after the event, but I mean, it's... Oh, they're following me from all the way over there. Alright, well, if you guys really want to come all this way to chase me... Kind of, a, kind of annoy me, then this is... I'm not in the mood right now, zombies. I'm hunting dragons. No offense. Trying to do stuff. Okay. As as I was saying before, I was interrupted. We're gonna take on the silver dragon. That's it. Hey, and we sold the soft souls as well. Yes. Nice. Alright, chat. We're so close to getting this enhanced onslaught. We're super close. I'm probably like 100k away, not even. I just, you know, I just gotta keep earning it. Once I can craft another set of those uh, pouches, we're gonna be within striking range. And you'll get to see how the uh, roll turns out. Actually, did those those dragons didn't even hit me, did they? Oh wow, that was awesome. Okay, I didn't even take any damage. 
feet. Hit stop. Let me see if I get anything good. Ooh, nice. That'll help pay for some of my other ammo. Alright, we're almost at the gold one now. Um, let me just see. Oh, we're by Comers. After the event, we're going to do a lot of Comers. I'm just trying to get the most out of this event right now. I hope in the future we have a trade app in mobile. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Um, I didn't see this uh, there. I hope in the future we have a trade app in mobile that we can buy and sell. Even. on Yeah. That we can buy. Well, that you can buy and sell that way, too. Yeah. Um, no, I get what you're saying. Um, yeah, there's some. You know, there's some stuff I hope that they add, too, you know? Oh, here we go. Uh... Uh -huh. Oh, nice. Was this a mission or something? Was this even a mission? Oh, hey, I, I think I lucked out. That's uh, one I didn't discover yet, I don't think. All right, so we got five minutes to take out this dragon. Let me just, uh, let me time this up here. We're going to use our uh, meds and all that. I have everything ready. I like to do that. I like to stop in at a house, heal, get my bearings, and kind of then go out and reset the purple zone. Sometimes looting the stuff around these. Oh, wow, that's great. I know that's a common Chesterfield, but trust me, that's a find. That's really good. Okay, um. That's really good. Sweet. Alright, time to take on the gold one. Let me see. I gotta think of... Oh, here it is. Uh-oh. Where's the zone here, right? We gotta head towards the zone. I'm just doing defensive shots because it's so close on me already. I need to get him jammed into these zombies more. Maybe these haystacks will cover me. Uh, my view's obstructed because of this stuff, though. I need to get him out and spray this stuff. I need to use the zombies as like a... Uh, like getting get his way a little bit. Okay, perfect, 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 perfect. That buys me time. Oh, but you know what? They, they cut that off. They cut that off. You see that? I think I gotta fight another one with fresh health. That sucks. I'm not trying to cheese it, I'm just trying to survive because I got all this little world after me, you know? I got the whole zombie army after me. I gotta reload and dodge him. Oh, that's my armor staff. I'm on a tree. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I'm, I'm done. 
That's so cheesy. They shouldn't respawn another one with full health, man. I wasn't trying to cheese it. I was just trying to survive. That that shouldn't happen in my mind. Oh well. Oh, I had that one. I feel like that that was a ripoff. Like I should have. That should not have happened like that. The dragon went wide, right? It disappeared. It shouldn't disappear. Why would it disappear, you know? Alright, so we'll, we'll heal. Uh, it's whatever, you know. You just gotta kind of let that go, I guess. It's a little annoying, though. You, you try not to let that get to you, but it's like... It was such a good battle, it was so fun, and just... Cheesy stuff happens where you get killed like that, I... We'll sell some stuff if we can. And then we'll heal. Which is going to cost me a little bit to heal all the way. What? Uh, okay, yeah, I was going to say that. 5k. Is this the... Uh... Oh, okay, that's a shotgun. Let me, let me double check. Just pick common. Okay, yeah, that is the going price. Interesting. Alright, I guess I'll heal. I wanted to win that battle. I thought I was doing everything right. I just got... I got cheesed a little bit by that. I... I basically fought, basically fought one and a half or two dragons, basically, because I put so much damage into them. All right, so you heal up, you know, you 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 move you move forward, you move on. It's just one battle. You know? As annoying as that was, we got to keep. Keep trying, right? I miss this sucks. Um <laughs> We got the armor full up, we got the health. Hey, what's up? Oh, yeah, because that would have been... I would have enough uh, envelope. I would have had enough envelopes for the uh, pouch. Okay. It's whatever. It's whatever. Uh, I'm just going to bring that one. Okay, cool. All right, guys. Yeah. We're almost there. Or like a hundred K away. Let me, let me actually see. Um, uh, let me see. The soft soul sold. Okay, so the net was two twenty nine five. You know, I was adding up the cost, and I think it was, what, 187 So I made 42k on the soft souls. Oh, hey, wow, we're at 884 Oh, yeah, because it keeps money in there. That's right. Uh, hold on. Wait a minute. Okay. Let me, let me do some number crunching here. You gotta see. Nope, not quite there. I don't know if I want to pay eight ninety either, right, guys? But I'm I'm so close. And what's the play? Soft Souls just sold, but ooh, 
that. Um, I think, okay, we've got the needles already. So let's just do some quick. Let's. 179k to make. 179k to make them. Um, so I'll make. Uh, 50k prop. You just got to do that real quick. You got to introduce them into the market ASAP. So that no one can, you know, so hungry. like you're trying to maximize that time to market as quick as you can. Because I mean, I'm what, 60k cheaper than the other ones? Players are going to see that and go, oh, wow, this is a deal. And it is, right? I mean, this is a deal. This is a deal. Hey, I'm, I'm trying to... Be modest about this. <laughs> you know, I'm not trying to inflate these. You can see the proof there. I, I would want to make another 60k, but I think that that's a fair, pro you know, more fair of a price. Once those sell and we have enough money to buy, actually, you know what? We got, I got to be patient. Yeah, these are going up crazy. I actually need to buy that now. One clue in the market, when you see an 8k difference on a, a crafting item like that, you gotta buy it now. It's 2, and then it's 66, 5, just like that. Boom, boom, boom. See? So, I got it for 55. You save all that money, and then that becomes, that becomes profit. As long as the item you're trying to craft sells. But yeah, these are going to keep going up because I think the market, the market's basically getting ready in anticipation of which item is going to be the next item that the grandmother will ask. For. I think it's going to be cloth. That's my opinion. I think it's going to be cloth again. It's been four different items so far. Actually, wait a minute. Yeah. You know what? You know, I'm gonna st I'm gonna pull. I'm actually gonna pull these cotton threads because it might be cotton thread. It might be. I'm gonna pull them because they might go up to 30k. I'm just gonna keep them in the stack. I don't have the, I don't have the room for this, but I mean, you know what I mean. Like that's my thinking though. Maybe I could offload. Some yeah, I just have a dedicated, like, crafting section where I'm kind of like, it's in mind of, like, what I need for uh, materials. Okay, so... I literally have no more space. I don't know what I'm going to do with all this stuff. I, I don't know what I'm going to... I mean, I want to sell all this stuff, but it's not... Uh, I need a minute to figure this out. Um... I mean, I can have some of these meds with me. I'm getting ready for the the switch over, though. So that's why I'm not selling any of that stuff just yet. Okay. It's not safe. The one after one more sale of the soft souls, I think that we'll be in business. Uh, we'll buy the we'll buy the credits and then we will we'll enhance the onslaught and I'm actually I'm gonna grab the one that I have in storage because that has the lower stat roll. That's what we're gonna do with. It. Um. Okay. So if it's survivor stew again, these soups would go up. So five k is not even a question for those. Those will be. You know, base price, probably. Um, we'll just throw a number here in some of these. They're probably going to be 10k again if it's if it's antiseptic spray. But I have so many. I'm just going to offload some of them.
And then we're going to price... Okay, I do want to price this unique again. I mean, this is like a super discount. You know what I mean? Okay. And then some of this other stuff's really valuable. Really, really good. I don't want to really undersell this stuff. There's nothing in the market like this SVD, but it's not selling. So I don't know. Maybe people don't know about it? It's a level 30 that has all this crazy stats on it. I don't know. That's the lowest I'm going to go. That's really it. That, I've, I've never seen an SVD with that kind of... For level 30. I got a lucky pull at uh, PCA. Okay, and then this this AR is kind of like a tombstone, like a mini tombstone. It's weaker, of course. That's why I'm like, why is it not selling? Anyways, guys, all we need is for one of those big ticket items to sell, and then we are in business. As you can see here, this is what I'm hoping it's going to sell. This is the unique that I got from PCA yesterday. I'm 100k under market, and it hasn't sold in a day, so I just think it's just no one's searching for them, possibly. But if anyone is watching this, and then they see that, they're going to save 100,000 if they wanted to get that for whatever they're trying to craft. Anyways. Okay. So, let's just... Um... Okay, so we sold some stuff. Let's re let's rerun these purple zones. We actually, oh, perfect. All right, so we're gonna go to Haverbrook. So I got we gotta you know block it out of our mind. Like hey, you know the gold the gold, you know that battle didn't go as planned. But we're gonna move forward and just try to take on uh, this next run of purple zones. I'm going to start with the warm-up, go and take on these zombies. And I don't need to use the sugar dragons for that. I just usually just use a car. Just get that extra mobility just to be, you know, there and back a little faster. And it's really not far away from the output. 200 and, what, 250 meters? It really isn't all that bad. Uh, welcome, everybody. So we are going through the purple zones here, guys, as per the theme of the video. The last video, um, the, uh, the theme was obviously taking out the uh, dragons, so um, we're going to continue that. But we're going to take on some of these neon zombies, too. I found a last resort that was going for 700k, but now it's down to 100k. It must be because of the keys for credit. Yeah. Yeah, that's causing all kinds of, uh, yeah. Yeah, like I was saying, guys, this would be a cool area to have, like, a PvP. <laughs> like a team deathmatch in the mansion area. That'd be really cool. You know how many people will be playing around this map? This would be so fun. Like, get rid of a lot of these trees, you know, this extra cover, but... All right, and I got to check some. Okay, so the XP I'm at 198.957. Okay, yeah, they're they're I'm Not trying to shoot you, I'm trying to shoot the EN zombie. There we go. Okay. We ran through that one and then we're going to Actually, we're not too far away from the silver one. I try to run silver every rotation because actually it's really not a bad purple. 
Hug. Come on. Come on. Come on, you're the only zombie out of all the zombies that sees me. See? At least I got it. I was hoping for ammo or something. Like, uh... Nine miller, twelve gauge or something. So we are within range, basically. Let me, let me, go to this house, the Wan Cottage. We'll go in here, take a minute, see if I get anything good. Oh, we got an antiseptic spray. Hey, who knows? That might be 10k in... Oh, and a traveler first aid kit. Nice. <laughs> That's awesome. Got that. We're gonna use these now. Free up a little bit of space. Alright, and then we're gonna take on the... Uh, dragon. Two silver dragons. Go. Took a little bit of damage. Let me make sure I'm not just running aimlessly. Oh yeah, I was running the wrong way. We'll go back this way.
I got it. Oh my gosh, that's that's an insane battle. Boy. Hey, did I? I'm trying to do like a grave shot, but like his tentacles getting the. Wind. Wow, that was crazy. Hey, we go, we uh, defeated him though, so that was really good. Whew. That was a that was a battle though, guys. I'm gonna go back to the outpost. That one. Hmm. Hey, we'll take a first aid kit, right? Nice. Oh, hey, I found a burns kit. Cool. Tinned Vegetable. We found some Tinned Vegetable. We made it back. Okay. I miss the sun. You miss the sun. Yeah, get it. Oh, fun fact. I found uh I found these sunglasses and they had a find food chance. I think they were like five hundred bucks or something. I used an elite enhancer on them. And they actually <laughs> it's kinda interesting. They got XP and uh damage versus mutated. If anyone if anyone wants them, I could lower the price a little bit too if anyone wants them. So find food chance. Think about that, right? You're going through the family residence. You could equip these sunglasses to all of your character. All it takes is finding what a, you know, however many bags of chips, and you basically, you basically, uh, it'll pay for it, you know, in the future. And you get all the XP. So when you turn in those missions, you get all kinds of XP with it too. Just something to think about. All right. I got to pull some of this stuff here. I got another uh, find book uh, weapon crab. <laughs> yep. Am I sure I want to stop? Well, if I had more space, I wouldn't. I wouldn't have to. Do I want to sell them. Later. 
I don't have to sell them that. Okay. Yeah, sell some meds real quick. We got some envelopes, so should, we should be able to craft another one of those pouches. Which is... Um, oh, and we got some shoddy ammo. Too. We're going to have to buy... Or, uh, I'm just going to have to buy ammo, sadly. Uh, let's figure this out. We're going to go to the stash. Okay. I'm going to craft one of these pouches. Okay. What can I do for you? What can you do for us, trader? What can we do for you? Do you need anything? Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to buy some more. Yikes. Almost ready to chainsaw some dragons. I'm at least going to try. <laughs> That's funny. Good luck. That is awesome. Okay. Let me, uh, so here, guys, um, anyone wants to join in the lobby, this is the info for the lobby. You guys want to join? More than welcome to if you want to take on some dragons or something. Just for laughs. <laughs> yeah. That that's funny. Uh okay, let's let's uh -huh. buy some ammo, I guess. Forty-eight hundred and oh, okay. Look. It's it's a bargain at forty-seven. <coughs> All right. We got a heal too now. Free up some inventory of that. All right. One, we're almost 1.1 million XP away from our prestige. Didn't I just tell you guys I was 3 million away? But this is what I'm saying, like, when you take out these dragons, you get a lot of XP. So I know on the surface, those silver ones don't seem like much, and, you know, they don't give as many envelopes, but you get a lot of XP for killing them. So that's something to consider, too. All right. Okay. All right, well, I'm... I'm just hoping for a hundred credits. Oh wait. Oh ten credits. I need ninety. I need ninety of them. Well, or a hundred stack. There was there was a there was a set of a hundred for a eight hundred K. I just I didn't have the cash to buy them. That sucks. I missed out. Okay, so yeah, these needles are up. I think that they're saying that these needles are actually going to be... It's more probable than the cloth. 
I don't know. I think it's going to be cloth, huh? So if I have, uh, okay, so here's my, here's what I think. <coughs> I think. Yeah, so I put that in the chat for you guys for reference. Um, based on what I'm seeing and the fact that it's been been a while since we've seen some of these items in rotation, I wouldn't be surprised. Honestly, that's what I think is going to happen. Don't go off just that, but keep it in mind. They did this before. Let's just take a quick look at some of these prints. Oh, chips are already up. Look at that. I'm not the only one that's thinking that, too. Chips were, what, 5,500? At what point in the stream, you get... Someone was saying... Okay, yeah, so... um, An hour... An hour ago. An hour ago, these were 5,500. Yeah... And they're buying up the chocolate bars too. You see that? These were what, sixty-five hundred maybe? They're buying up the chocolate bars too. Chocolate spreads are coming down as they should, because we're getting closer to the reset. So don't buy any. Obviously, sell them if you can. This isn't a bad idea. I'm going to buy some of these sugar dragons because I think it's either going to be lunar cake or it's going to be sugar dragons, guys. I'm telling you. It's one. It's going to be one of these two things. I'm like 90% certain it's going to be one of these two things. Because the lunar mom has only been asking out of a rotation four different items. So it's already been Survivor Stew, what, the other day? I think it's going to be one of these two, but probably the Lunar Cave, if I had to get. We'll buy a couple more. That's probably good for now. Because I do use these when I run around and take out the uh, dragons. I do need to uh, make sure I have enough of them. I try, to, I try to get the most out of them. You know, one per every, what, two purple zones or whatever. Because they last for 12 minutes. Okay. Probably buy a couple more coffees. We'll die up there. We're so close to getting these uh, credits. And it's just a matter of time. All right. I don't know about today. I think one of the days they're going to throw us a curveball and it'll be like crazy random items or something. I, you know what I mean? It's one of these days, it's going to be the last day, maybe. They may not care and just make it whatever. I don't know. You know what I mean? Like rice or something. Who knows? But uh, we got some... Oh, okay. We got some dragons to take. We're going to go take out some silver dragons. So we'll see we'll see how close I am to being right across the board. The ammo could be any ammo. Right? I don't know, you know. It's been nine millimeter what the past couple days, I think. Um, I'll just say for like a guess. We'll just say three fifty eight or thirty eight special. Okay, technically. If I had a, a absolute guess. It's been a while for antiseptic. That that's what I'm saying. I feel I feel like it's it's coming up. I I just you know. 
and crab, I mean, I have a couple hundred of them. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> one of these days, it's going to be antiseptic spray. I, I think it's just a matter of time. You know? And I'm saying that is it's kind of, like, crazy to me. Like, I, I would never have any reason to buy that many, you know? But because of this event, it's like you're playing the market game. I, I can play that game. I've made a couple videos on that. I, I can play the market game. <laughs> Hey, if they want to play that game, we can play that game, right, guys? <laughs> we we know how to play that game. I've got I've got a, two cars full of antiseptic sprays. <laughs> I dare them to make that the item. But uh, no, in all seriousness, no. Um, I think a lot of this is like, man, you know, just trying to you know get these. Uh, Red envelopes to craft this stuff is pretty fun, I think. I wish they had a bit more stuff you could craft. I mean, it's, it's good, but don't get me wrong. You know? I'll take the rifle and the mask, though. Yeah, I mean, it's good. Oh, that's... I wasn't expecting that sound. Yeah, it kind of... It shook up a bit. I didn't expect that. Like, wow! What was that? Scaring me. The zombies are scaring me. All right. Yeah, the zombie did more damage than the uh, dragon did. Mm, can I get there in time? Uh, I'm gonna try. I'll try to get to the red, uh, the gold one in time. I don't know, guys. We'll Welcome everybody. <clears throat> we are trying to run through some purple zones to take on the dragons. Hey, Dodgers breast sold. Yes. <laughs> yes. Crab, it sold. I'm gonna. I'm gonna run the. Uh, I'm gonna run the crafting for you guys. For those that are tuning in, thank you. Uh, good, good to see everybody. Um, welcome. We are on the way to the uh, hmm. purple zone here. Hmm. Yeah, very nice. And after this, I might have to take a little bit of a break. This felt a little off there for a second. I don't know what that... Weird. Yeah, so maybe we can get to this gold one in time. I think my buffs are still active, right? Holiday high, it says. Holiday high, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It uh, it sold, so that was like uh, I think it'll be like 595k net off of that. I got that from running PCA. But I, I try to tell everyone try to run PCA every day if you can. You never know what they'll get.
got it. Wow. All right, time to go back. We only had one minute left to make that, uh, that, take that dragon out. Okay. All right, so here's what we'll do, guys. I'm going to head back to the um, outpost. I need to take a bit of a break, I'm thinking. I don't know. Um, probably need a good 15 minutes. That's just because, I don't know, like out of nowhere, I just kind of felt a little off. Um, I'm still going to try to, you know, continue. That said, um, we're going to go back to the outpost. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh-oh. Oh, maybe I could finish the... Nope, I got panic. Shoot. It caught me off guard. Uh-oh. Oh, all my buffs are That's just unlucky, that's just unlucky. Oh, I got it still. Oh. Wow. Yeah, yeah, because I wasn't expecting that, right? That's why I'd like to be able to, like, stack the use of these beds so, like, you could use uh, multiple panic ones to, like, stack. So, like... Oh, I used one for five minutes, but then I can use another one to get ten, or I don't know, you know what I mean? Up, you know, up to, up to three or something. But, all right. Ooh, well, we made it. All right, great. So let's uh, check it out here. Hey, it's sold. Wow. All right, we have enough, guys. So this will be yeah. So we'll um we'll craft this craft this first because I'm I'm just I'm excited and then uh, I'm gonna take my break. Um. Uh, wait a minute. No. Unfortunately, that wouldn't... I'd be 15 credits sh uh, If I were to buy those two. No, I gotta buy... I gotta buy... Badly. Alright. Alright, guys. Let me think which character has the other rifle. I think it's on. Yeah, I can't just craft it. I need I need a second. So is it? I have to remake the lobby though. But it's fine. It's fine. Um okay. So I think it's this character. We'll just join a memo. Don't mind me. I just have a few antiseptics. <laughs> Just imagine that all those are 10k. Alright, so uh, here's the one I want to enhance. Oh, actually, wait. But it's got the red dot on it. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to spend credits to get rid of that. I'm gonna have to... I gotta think about it. I have to think about it. I'm 
Let me think. And I don't want to craft it with this character anyway. Not that it matters. Because I would need 400 envelopes and 50k to make another one. But maybe that's all right because it does have at least a scope on it. It doesn't, I guess it doesn't have to be the end game scope. Okay. All right. I think, I think that's my final answer. I think I'm just going to do it. Um, whatever. And I got some inventory, so you know what? We're just going to stack up on. I need to free up some space for my stash. Whatever it takes. You gotta do whatever it takes. Oh yeah, so guys, with all my characters, I have a backpack and all the inventory stuff. Their cars are full of gear, everything. <laughs> oh god. Give you a pre we'll give you a preview. So uh Later in the stream, probably, I might switch over to these characters, but we'll give you an idea. We got Trader Market Guide. <laughs> and just another uh, alt. And then uh, Cherry Birkin. That'll be, that'll be later, though. I couldn't help it. <laughs> oh, God. This game, I tell you. All right, let's go to the stash. Oh, hey, what's up, foolish? All right. Uh, paint it black. Yeah. Oh, I do have a black dye. What's up, hut? Hmm. How's it going? Okay, so I'm just trying to think. This is the this is the one I want to enhance. Right? I'm going to unequip the other one cuz I don't want it to get confused. Let me put my other one away. Uh this is the this is the okay. That's the one I was using. Okay. We're going to Put those envelopes away. Okay. So I threw a red dot sight on this one. When the red dot sights were like 100k. Let me think. Okay. So I put a red dot sight on this one when they were 100k and now they're what 350 320 okay uh these scopes are out of control i don't know yeah i mean might this might be the best up i've gotten all right guys thank you for the like by the uh thank you for the like by the way too okay guys so we're gonna put a uh stream uh, i'm gonna put a marker for this stream uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a chat. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna put a, uh, marker. Okay, I added a marker. Okay. This is it, guys. This is what I've been working, like, days for grinding not re not repairing armor uh we are gonna craft the onslaught so i just want to be sure it's in my inventory this is the regular one i have the scope on it so yeah we're gonna we're going to uh, i'm so excited <laughs> we're gonna enhance the dragon onslaught and see how it turns <laughs> Do it. There's the roll. 
Bam. Now that's a hitter. That's a hitter, guys. This is a rifle. Oof. That's a nice roll. Bam. That's that's awesome. Okay. So let's see how it compares to the other one. Let's see how they compare. Um, let's compare them. Actually, I'm going to equip. I'm just going to equip the regular one just to see where we kind of came from. All right. So we gained 8% headshot damage. We gained 4% body damage. We gained 4% attack speed. We gained 8% damage versus mutated. We gained 5% infected. And we gained 2% draw. I think uh I think that's that's the whole we're gonna equip it. And then now we can check the stats. So my headshot was what, 79.11 or something? But that's uh you know seventy it was seventy seven. Point one, I think. So that went up a little bit, but that's that's without um. Was that survivors too? Go. But then that it's going to be that damage, and then the mutated is now two thirteen. We got two thirteen now with the mute, and that's without the snow. Hunter pouches, which is what I really want from the, my uh, jeans, like uh, when I eventually get to that point. So I could be at 221. So we're still not done yet with getting there. I mean, that's still really good progress. Wow, that was a fantastic. One more time, we'll just. Compare these. So I gained another 8% headshot damage. I mean, that's not insignificant. Not insignificant. But the mutated was a huge difference. I mean, 8% different. So that's uh, more than a level in mutated, if you were to think of it that way. And then I got a little bit more in the way of jog speed, too. So... In my mind, I was trying to think, okay, well, if I got more drog speed, would I take away a level in jogger? But I got plus two, so I think I would just keep it as is. Uh, you know, I think I just keep it. So, it'll perform a little better with the uh, red dot. Too. Fantastic, though. Okay, I'm, I'm stoked about that. So, we will... Um, Put this away, this other stuff away, and then I gotta take a bit of a break, guys. Sorry, but uh, I do, um, just because I don't know, I felt kind of, you know, off a little bit for whatever reason here. So we're gonna just take a minute. So here's what I'll do. Put this. Put this. So my so like my second rifle character like co main will have the other onslaught, which is still really good. You guys saw I was using it for a while, so it's obviously still really good. Yeah. Alright everyone, so welcome. Hmm. Thanks for stopping by all. Um we just crafted the dragon, the enhanced dragon's onslaught guy. For anyone just tuning in, uh, on the right there, that is the roll that I got uh, on mine. I think it turned out pretty good. Dog speed was a little lower than I expected. It just it's it's one over the base. It's still an improvement over what I had though. But every everything was an improvement. The the headshot damage was the most drastic. So I think we can check that off of the uh, to do list for in terms of what you know for this uh, event 
what to do. Um, yeah, I had to buy 500 credits, but you know what? Worked hard for it, grinded, and, and got it done. And, and we ended up crafting a rifle that's going to be just that much better in, in the uh, fight in you know, in the battles. So I think all I'm going to do now is just save up those envelopes to buy these uh, pouches of endless luck and then the elite enhancer uh, crafting as well. So um, we can keep that going. I will have to do something about this inventory situation. As well. But for now, uh, what we'll do... Uh, let me see. Give me... Let's... Okay, so I'm just kind of making sure I have everything ready for uh, later here. So, great. That was fun. So here's what we'll do. Um... I need about need about twenty minutes. I gotta take a break. This wasn't feeling right, so we'll see if that helps. When when I come back, when I'm back, we will go through. We'll continue to go through these uh, purple zones uh, where applicable for the dragons. Sometimes the neon zombies too. Um, I am in MMO right now. I was in a lobby, but. Uh, we can, we can, I can run another one if you guys want, uh, whoever wants to join. But for now, we're in the MMO, the NA MMO. Um, we're at Greywood, so if anyone wants to join up, we can take on some dragons then. Uh, thanks, everyone, for stopping by. And again, thanks for uh, 1K subs. I appreciate that, everybody. Um, and if you're new to the channel, and feel free to subscribe if you want to. Uh, we will be back here in about, uh, about 20 minutes. So I'll put that in the chat and we'll go from there. Thanks guys. Catch you in a bit.
There it is. Did you hear it this time? Hold on, it's, it's gone again. I've got to mm. find it. That signal.
This is the Pale Haven Security Council broadcasting to all survivors. <coughs> Please bring any supplies you find back to the safe house for distribution to those in need. Stay safe out there. All right, everybody, thanks for waiting. Give me just another 30 seconds here. Back from break. Well, give me 30 seconds. We're just going to switch everything over here. Alrighty, guys. <clears throat> Give me one second. Okay, hmm. we are back, everybody. Thanks for waiting. Sorry for the wait. So, um, I just had to take a break because I wasn't, uh, you know, just not quite felt my best. Still, you know, not a hundred percent. But we are back for a little while here. Um, okay. So just to recap for everybody, we've been running these um, purple zones. Run, uh, running those to get some envelopes today. You can see here we got, what, 84. So we've been kind of saving them up. Uh, I just have to check something in the market here real quick. I've got nothing. Mm. 
Oh, I thought I priced these. Maybe not. Let me... How long can this go on? How long can this go on? I don't know, trader. Five years? Okay. I think I meant sixty fifty nine. Okay. All right. <laughs> Did they sell already? What? Yeah. They sold that fast, eh? I guess so. Oh, I was going to say. Okay, so, um, hmm. let's see here. So, just to recap for everybody, we've been running through the purple zones, taking out the dragons, and we're going to continue that. We'll set the marker for the silver ones. I went ahead and I did it. I enhanced the Dragon's Onslaught. So this is how it turned out. You know? Overall, I think it was pretty good. It's definitely, you know, it is an upgrade to what I, you know, was using. You know? Especially the headshot damage. That was, that was really good. So, you know, there's that. Yeah, yeah. This this took a lot of effort, man. I got a good roll. Yep. Yep. Hey, that's what I was hoping for, especially with the headshot attack and mutated. It was kind of all like lined up. You know, so that that uh, turned out well. Worth it. Yep. It was worth it. So we got that. Um, and then you guys know I rolled the uh, the Neon Mask here the other day. So really, two good rolls with this stuff. So really, honestly, I'm pretty happy about that. Full stats? Yeah. Yeah, I got you. <clears throat> Full stats... So I'm at 79 now on the uh, rifle. Pretty close. It's pretty close to the shotgun, which is hilarious. Usually that doesn't happen. Um, but these are the other stats. So now we're at 213 on um, mutated. So. I do have some, I do have some capacity to get even more so because um, the next the next move I was gonna do was, uh, I have to spend credits to do this. But for the G the joggers that I've got, I'm gonna get rid of the greedy pouches. I'm gonna put the snow hunter ones on there. That'll give me another eight percent mutated here. And we're still trying to work on this incoming damage number. It's really helping out fighting these dragons with the higher incoming damage. Percent. So the more the better here. And really, honestly, next for the build, guys, is going to be... I want to get more walk speed. Sprint speed and sprint dura. This is my goal right here. Like this movement area. That's my focus now. Movement and damage reduction. Because now we've got we've got the A quality sniper. I say we have an A minus shotgun. Now we gotta go for you know other upgrades. Sweet, you can take everything in level 50 zones. Well yeah, I mean I've been at, I've been working at this for a long time. <laughs> Trying to, you know, methodically refine that over time and improve, so. Just seeing if there's any good missions here to do in the meantime. 
Yeah. Pouches of endless luck have sold. Okay. All right, so we're getting some of that cash back. Okay, that's good. All right, that's cool. All right, guys. Well, great. So, hmm. I guess let's run the silver dragons while there's still time. And we're going to put this rifle to the test, guys. I put this rifle to the test. There we go. Clean. <clears throat> Alright, let's take on the gold one. And so, the difference between this rifle and the one I was using, the regular, in addition, is... Uh, this one, um, the original. This is the original uh, rifle that I I rolled originally. Uh, well, anyway, so um, I had before before the red dot sights inflated. Uh, they were like a hundred k each, so I just I bought one of those and I'm glad I did actually because they're over 300k now so I think that was kind of a blessing in disguise so I saved 200k and I'm and it ends up ironically being the one that I'm using because I use uh, this is the one I enhanced, so I still kept the good one, the one with the you know decent stats. You know. Number two character, like you know, like co-main or number two, basically. All right, so let's make sure we got the panic, resist. All right, make sure we've got full health, too. All right, I got to keep my eyes peeled. Where is this dragon I come from? I need to get in this house and resync it. Out. That's what we're going to do. We've got six minutes left. Let's duck in here. Let's duck in here. <laughs> Binary? Well, that's interesting. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go. It's going to, the moment I step out, I think it's going to be purple zone time. No, that's not it. I see it in it, yeah.
go. Whew. I hit pretty good there, but I survived. Yeah, I got half health. Yeah, well, what, 40%? I'm just kind of in scramble mode, I'm not sure. All does pretty good. I can definitely tell a difference with the accuracy from having that other scope. It's a little bit more accurate, too. 10% might not seem like a lot, but it actually matters. It, it actually makes a difference. Because each shot, each each shot, the faster you shoot, that reticle is going to go out more, more, more. So it, it does matter when you're trying to get that attack per second up. You know, aim, speed, and all that kind of factors into it. Alright, so that was, uh, I would say that was a success. I'm still alive, you know, I could have easily got crunched there. The dragon hit me pretty good, though. Okay, we made it back. I'd say that that went pretty well. I, you know, overall. Could have been worse. <laughs> okay. Whew. We'll have to heal up, though. Tried soloing gold. Something got me though. Yeah, yeah. Um, some of those, some of those zombie. I mean, they get in the way for sure, which is uh quite unfortunate. Let me just check something. You actually think you can survive out there? <laughs> we think we we think we can survive. We know we can survive. Crater. Kind of what I was hoping not to see. Do not believe their lies. What can I do for you? 
What can you do for me? What can we do for you? Can I buy this item because it's no longer sale? I found the method, but I can only get like two or three shots, and lucky I have a low dodge cooldown. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dodging against that's it's critical. That's kept me alive plenty of times. Otherwise, I don't know how many more deaths I would have taken from. All right, we got to heal up a little. Uh, let me just see here. Get some cheap meds, I guess. Along with the rest of us. I'm pretty much playing Dark Souls at this rate. <laughs> hmm. Need to buy a couple. Need to buy a few more meds, and then I should be uh, healed again. Mm, that's probably good. I'm just going to take a look at some market stuff. No, su no surprise here. Hmm. Let's see if there's any books. I was coping. I was kind of hoping one of these uh, pairs of gloves would be lower price. I can snag them and then run an enhancer. On. They're all over. Yikes! Okay. Five k bag of potato chips. That's probably. No, it's not. Sixty-two thousand for a last bird. What what were these before the event? Like ten k? They're like naughty. I don't know. What were, I can't even think of what they. Eight k. <laughs> the Easter cakes are cheaper. Easter cakes from last event are cheaper than the birthday cakes. And we got the sugar dragons. Quick water break. Hmm. Okay. So, and I'm running out of inventory. I want to buy some of this stuff, but I don't want to go crazy. Buy a couple of them. I gave my predictions above in the chat, but I don't know, you know. Hmm. I guess we'll find out. Find out in what? Two, two hours or so here? 
what the new uh, items are going to be. Oh, the uh, silver one's right there. Silver one's right there. When is refresh? Yep, no problem. All right, everybody, let's go. Uh, kind of by a PvP zone, but let me just. If I go this way, by angle. Okay, yeah, we're gonna bypass. Yesterday, when the server reset buttons were up to 100k. Oh, oh, I know, I saw. Yeah, yeah, that was insane. Um. Yeah, could have profit 70k if I was a bit early. Oh, oh, I know. Yeah. Well, that's the, that's the thing, you know. The the day that it was leather, right? The day that it was leather, I was glad that I bought that. I bought like 10 leather beforehand, like kind of anticipating. There we go. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Pete. Good help. Good help. I'll try to help you. They might be going to gold. Let's see. No, I don't think so. Okay, I'm going to have to heal a bit. If I'm going to have that health that I've got, I may as well get the max when I go in to fight the gold. I don't want to be lower than the, the number I've got. Especially with all the times it can kind of, you know, fade in and out and kind of do that thing. Alright, well... I can get to a house that right. Okay, I see. Okay. Yeah, the zombies in the chest. Okay, we got some twelve gauge. And coffee green. Bolt wrap. Bolt with a key. Uh-oh, I'm not messing with those. I learned my lesson from last uh, event. Any of the optic Christmas ones was like, uh, no. Because they take so much, so much damage. Ooh, rifle round. That was good. 
Small key. I'm not going to really be in here. I was just kind of checking a couple rooms here real quick just to see if I could get some quick loot, you know. Oh, it's an app. Antibiotics. Okay, that's we use though. Uh, I don't know. All right. Uh, one more door, I guess. Here. Painkillers, okay. Oh, sweet. Yeah, I could scrap it. It'll, it'll, it'll have some value. Okay. All right, let's, uh, let's see here. We still got... Okay, so the panic resist, I'm going to have to probably run that. All right, let's let's go to the gold one. <clears throat> the thing, too, was that buying a button was a last second buy. Oh, yeah, the timing on that's interesting. Timing on that. I was fortunate. I just had that thought to just buy leather two hours before and i just had a feeling it was going to be leather and i was right uh i'm gonna get out of this fight No, where did it go? No! That happened last time. Oh my gosh. No, you gotta be kidding me, man. It did that last time, didn't it, guys? That's stupid. I would have had to kill a fresh uh, dragon again. I'm, I'm already weakened. I wouldn't win that. Even with the upgrade. Uh, hey, at least I got some rifle rounds. Oh, man. Oh, I got a heal. I got a heal. I, was, I took some significant... Ouch. Well, that's why I bring the meds here. Yeah, my armor's yeah, under half now. Okay. Hmm. I think sometimes hmm, it's just not. I don't know. I'm going to try it again. I get The moment I get out of this building, I'm going to be. I just need to know why it's happening with this. Oh, I get why. Yeah, yeah. I need to get off this street. Get off this. It's kind of wonky. Even though I'm in the zone, it's like being funky. <clears throat> I need to go to my blue rally point, and I just need to book it. Okay. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Get in, get in, get in. I gotta see if it got cheesy damage on me. No, it didn't. Whew. We gotta do this slowly but surely. We're gonna... We're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. I see it. I see it. I see it. Okay. 
See if I can loot this in front. Okay. All right. Perfect, this is what we want. Oh, we got stuck. That we don't want. I'm in trouble, I think. I'm not in this one. Oh, that's so crap. I got it. Oh my gosh. It would have killed me if I didn't kill it there. Let's go, chat. That would have been KO. I would have died. My armor was broke. You see that? If it got that last breath off, I would have died. Insta die. That extra attack speed. Even if it's a minimal boost, it was just enough where I lived and survived because of I just got off one more bullet by the time it was able to KO me. I'm going the wrong way. We're going the wrong way. That's also why I bring my backup armor plate. But I don't switch to it mid battles. Kind of wondering even if I should, because I kind of just go to the outpost anyway. I don't know. I'd, I guess I'd rather have it than. Yeah, that's where. I'll, I'll keep it. I just gotta keep an eye. So, like, in three minutes, these purple zones are gonna rotate. Or reset, you know. The... Oh, I'm still getting followed. You gotta be Alright, we're almost back to the output. Whew. Well, that was something else. That was an epic fight. Armor broke and I still survived. If you can get to a point where the dragon just does a glancing blow against you instead of an actual panic hit, or like a direct hit, you have a chance. It's easier said than done, though. Okay. Okay, so let's sell some stuff. Pay for my uh, armor repairs. Uh -huh. Hey. Soda for 1200 bucks. Do I buy one? 
I'll buy I'll buy one. No longer for sale. Whoa, 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 whoa. Something's up with the uh, server there. Give me one second, guys. <laughs> 